Hello everybody, how the devil are we doing? Are we all doing okay? How are we all behaving ourselves? Had a fun day? Done anything interesting? Right, we, we were planning on playing Persona 5 today, but it kind of didn't happen because we've been doing an awful lot of different stuff, um, doing interviews and stuff like that. So we're just going to uh, jump on some Destiny 2, murder our way around a few things, and uh, save the galaxy a few times, hopefully. We will soon see if we are successful. Uh, let's see who else is on as far as we can buy it. There we got one person, but he's watching Twitch. Is he going to join? <laughs> this is where it's going to turn around and go. No, really, really. Oh, there we go. I was waiting for it to turn around and go. No, sorry, can't play. Gail Prime, good afternoon, sir. How the devil are you doing? Are you doing all right today? Elk! How are you doing? Are you doing okay as well, Elk? Are we all doing okay, chap? Where is Zer this week? Can only be in a limited amount of places. I'm just going to tower see if he's in the... Are you still celebrating your um, your election win, Elk? Uh, doing good things. Haven't seen or played Destiny 2 in ages. I, I've got some stuff I need to do on Destiny 2. That, um, the season is coming to an end, I think, on the 20th. And a new season is starting. They're introducing a new element called Strand. So everybody's going to go, ooh, yeah, you know. We get to play with all of these things that allow us to float in midair and lasso across things. So it'll be interesting to see what it's like. Uh, oh man, today I found a great, great fuck up in my job. It will cost me 12 grand. Ooh, that's not good, Elk. Hopefully you can fix it. Hopefully you can fix it without it costing you 12 grand. Kags, thank you for the sub. How are you doing, Kags? Are you okay? No, celebrations are over. Well, I suppose that's that's probably, probably uh, partly a good thing. You know, celebrations are over, down to business. No wasting any time. Uh, oh, 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 I think he's at the tower. I think we made a good decision there, chat. Yeah, we did. Sir's at tower. Perhaps this is why the nine sent me here. Uh, hi there, Kags. Hi, cutie. Yeah, I... Oh, no, we've got the Saurus. We don't need the Saurus. Uh, uh, average. See... I need the mobility on those, on those ones. I need the resistance on those, on those ones. Because they've got the wrong classes on them. 63 is a good roll, but there's just no... I want mobility down, strength down. No, no, I want mobility down, intellect down. Resilience, recovery, discipline up, and then strength is my fourth. But... We will have a look at what we've got. If we got the mission off, sir. Is it your will to return? Oh, I haven't completed it. No, I literally can't. Oh. Are you going to have to like start the job over again? Or is it just a case of you're going to lose that 12 grand and that's going to be it? Uh, I'm all right. Been a lazy, uh, been lazy all day. So on the way to work. See, it was I've been at work all day. Just now, I'm just being lazy. Uh, Wolfie, how'd the interview go? The interview went really, really well. Um, speaking to the woman taking the interview, she said, "Yeah, absolutely loved your energy. Absolutely loved the way you were answering all the questions. You could back everything up that you were uh, that you were trying to do. Yeah, 
think it's brilliant. The job is for £30,000 a year. Now, at the moment, I'm on 34. Um, I just fucked that up. I just picked that out to put into there, and I've just fucking deleted it. Oh, fuck a duck. Oh, and there's no way to get it back. It's gone. Um... Oh, right, okay. Gear level is 15.89, so I've just got to grind and I'll get it. That's fine. Um, I know no reason to cause you harm. Um, so, yeah, they, I'm on 34 at the moment. The job I'm they're sure offering is 30. But I've said, um, you know, I, I can't really afford to just lose four grand a year. So she's going, no, absolutely, completely understand. And I believe that people should get paid what they're worth. And it's like, right, okay. She said, and from your answers, I'm putting you in at 35,000. And it's like, oh, okay, I'll uh, I'll accept that. She went, you might not get that. They might obviously haggle down a little bit, but it's easier for us to start high and go down a little bit than start low and try and go up. Uh, I will lose those 12 grand, which I don't have. Jesus, Elk, what, what happened? Are you, like, not meeting a deadline or something? Or... Nice one. Great question. What about the interview? Um, yeah, but it was a bit weird though, because during the interview, um, and I, at the, oh, sorry, let's, let's, let's just repeat right. At the end of the interview, I always ask the same question, which is, please, can you give me some feedback information? And I said, because, quite frankly, if I've done something wrong, Hello. or if I could improve, Welcome. I need you to tell me. I, I need constructive feedback. If you don't know, you can't improve. And she went, no, no, your confidence is brilliant. Um, she said, you've practiced an awful. Oh, pardon me. Um, you've practiced an awful lot, and it's like, no, I, I don't practice interviews at all. And she went, really? But you're, you're just so confident about everything you say. It's like, yeah, I read up on the company, and I'm a salesman. We're literally paid to be fucking confident. That's that's what we do. I said, I, you know, before I was in sales, I did, um, I did training. I said, I spent years stood at the front of a classroom for two, three days a week every week with four complete strangers going right guys i'm the expert and you guys are the newbies by the time we finish this you guys you might not be experts but you're going to be pretty damn good because i'm going to make you that good because quite frankly it reflects on me how can i help so i said yeah so you know you have to be confident you have to get across to people you have to adapt to the situation I'll be here. and she went no absolutely love it absolutely fantastic uh I'm over here deciding to quit work or continue working. Cags, it all depends whether you can afford to do it, isn't it? I mean, if I could afford to quit working, I would quit working. It's that simple. Uh, no, but as I work with advertisements, I fucked up the client's budget and found that out today. Ah, shit. What, so are, are you, you've gone over budget? Or... Uh, well, exactly. Uh, uh, exactly. Well done, Wolfie. Uh, I can afford it. It's no problem. Fair enough. So I, I would love to be in a position where I could afford not to ever work again. Or I'd love to be in a position where I could make streaming my work. But I'd have to be a bit bigger to do that. Uh, oh, shit. That's the point. I don't think we've done any missions from... Oh, we have. We've touched it. So we've got to do some heist battlegrounds. We've got to focus another engram. That's fine. Okay, well, without further ado, let's do some heists then. Master Wikipedia's farmer. That's piece of pins. Oh, we've got to do strikes as well. We've got to do strikes again at the hive boss. Damn it. Uh, we've got to do nightfall on... Let's do nightfall on a hero because that might get us the strike and it might, and it should hopefully get us this one. Let's, let's do Nightfall on here, right? I, um, uh, for some cats, yeah, but you're, you're a professional cat sitter, aren't you, uh, Gail Prime? So, you know, oh, it, you like cats, and if you're a, a professional cat sitter, you know, you do what you love. You never work a day in your life. Why I want to play video games for a living. <laughs> uh, barrier and unstop arc, but lightning crystals, we say? Arc and stasis. Oh, you receive more damage from both animals. Yeah, screw that for a game. Um, right, so... Wait. Has that got it built in? 
Yes, that's got it built in. So, we are going... You know what? We haven't used the avalanche in a while. Let's put the avalanche on. I'm going to put that on. We just need unstop. Which I bet I now can't do. I bet unstop's going to be... Unstop his hand cannons. Yes, sir. They're not cheap. They're good. Yeah, I don't have a hand cannon here. Fusion those. Right, fine. Screw it. We'll do it a different way. We'll put that on. We'll put that on. And we'll put the Galahorn. It's fine. Which means we're not going to get as much super energy as I'd like. Bow on. Bow on. Yes, because that's. That's scout. Yeah, put the bow on. Right, that'll do it. That'll do it. Um, uh, I mistakenly spent one client's budget on the other client without knowing because invoices were not separated. How much is that? Um, and obviously, that other client can't pay that because it was my mistake and I don't work with them anymore. Um, is there no way you can speak to the two clients and see if there can be some sort of range, arrangement worked out? Because if, if worst case scenario, the whole point in planning this is worst case scenario is if you do have to pay it, then you have to sit down and you have to say, look, you've got to figure out some sort of payment plan. I can't just give you 12 grand. I don't just have 12 grand. So it might be... It might be a shit situation that you find yourself in for years, but it could be something where you pay a small amount back every every time, which, don't get me wrong, it's a situation nobody wants to be in. I hate being in that situation. But it's you've got to find a, a situation that leads you so you can still live. I know for Walla, if somebody turned around to me today and said, you owe me £12,000, I would not be able to pay it. It'd be that simple. But if they turn around and say, you owe me £12,000, right, okay, we're going to take £100 off you every month. It's like, yeah, okay, £100 is going to suck. Um, but yeah, I can manage that. Uh, that's not an option. Uh, those money went on Google, etc. Those money are gone and the people won't pay more than they have in the agreement. Oh, hmm. It, it's going to have to be a discussion, isn't it? it I'm, it's not going to not going to be a pleasant discussion, but you have to discuss it. Um, because you, you can't bury your head in the sand on it. Um, you can't sort of run away from it. It's one of those things. It is. It. I elk. My heart goes out to you. It really does. If I had twelve thousand pounds or twelve thousand euros to give you elk, I would give you twelve thousand euros. But I just I don't have that money either. Chat, let's have a whip round for uh let's have a whip round for elk. Let's see if the uh chat can get out twelve thousand pounds. Uh and the cherry on top, I need to give those monies together and uh till next month. Uh, and next month I have to pay taxes. Fuck. Elk, start having conversations now. Get ahead of it. Don't let don't let time run down and bury your head in the sand. Face it head on. And say, look. Fucked up. Really, really sorry. Fucked up. I know I fucked up. But we're going to have to have discussions about this and we're going to have to figure it out. Because worst case scenario, absolute worst case scenario, is if they if they basically say, no, you've got to give us the money back and you don't have the money, you'll have to turn around and say, look, I'm bankrupt, can't have the money, it's that simple because I don't have it. Um, and as much as it might suck, you'd have to go stay with your parents again. Which they don't want that to happen because if that happens... Although, yeah, you feel really bad. It doesn't get them their money back, does it? Oh, that was a shit grenade throw. 
Oh, I'm gone. What are you? You're a barrier. Oh, dude! That barrier is determined not to be hit by me. Oh, he got hit once and he died. Oh, no, he didn't. No, he did. Um, oh, fuck. I have one P and a spare button. Surely the company you work for has insurance to protect you against this kind of thing. So actually, I have to put together 24k because my taxes are also 12. Fucking hell. Uh, so far, I have five. This month, I should be able to get another eight more. That pile, so I'll make... Yeah. The thing is, though, so that's that's what you do then. You, you turn around and go, right, I've got five, and I can get another eight. So that's 13. You basically, you have to pay your taxes... So, you take the 12 to pay your taxes, and then you say to the people, look, really, really sorry, fuck this up. Here's here's a thousand, a thousand euros. I will be trying to get the rest of it together. We're going to have to form some sort of payment plan, um, because I cannot afford to do this like this. Like the, the, the funds are just not available. Um, or you speak to the tax tax office and say look yep yeah, not not trying to get out of paying my tax not at all but is there any way to make a payment plan on the tax so that way you do have to pay the tax but you can pay it over a couple of different installments and then at least that way you have basically you get payment plans in place if you can for the taxes and for the um for the company and then that way, if you've got 13,000 and let's say the taxes want 3,000, the company wants 3,000, that means you have at least 7,000 left where you can turn around and go, right, look, I can keep this back. I can do anything I need to do. I can then, you know, keep whatever I need in place for the payment plan. But it means you can also carry on. Um, we have a different currency, but yeah. Beans on toast for breakfast. Uh, see, Gale Prime, you say beans on toast. I think it's just toast. Oh, sorry, guys. Uh, right, you've gone that way, you've gone that way. Guess I'll defend the central platinum. Fucking... I can't hit with a Galahorn. It's a homing rocket launcher. I can't hit with it. Ah. Well, there's my plate done. You know what? Screw it. There's my bow. Oh, I murdered him. Absolutely outright murdered him. You're still... Let's go over and help me. Uh, no, the Reaper's done. Bye! Uh, no, more like I'll buy one chicken each week and some potatoes and veg. It'll give me five meals and two big soups. Best diet is the one you can't break. <laughs> the best diet is the one you can't break. Right, I thought about buying chicken and potatoes, but I can only afford the cardboard box they come in. Oh, I thought I'd frozen for a minute there. It's just a little bit of lag. Lashy lights everywhere. Yeah. Um, if Inhibio comes on, um, and because we both play Void, um, we very much have a case of everything is purple. There you go. Now, Alk, all I can say is speak to people as quickly as possible and say look i don't have 12 grand to pay you um 
we're going to have to form a payment plan. I'm not trying to get out of it. I'm basically saying, you want your money back, or you you want the, the money that I, I owe, or whatever. I want to pay it, but we have to come to some sort of term with this. Uh, chicken over here is like 200, so that's not much of an issue. So I believe I could make make it up to 500, 600 per week. Hey, at least you're not in the US. I mean, eggs cost a fortune in the US. Yeah, funny thing is I haven't told my client. I can fully understand why. I can fully understand why. You never know, Alk. Your client might be incredibly understanding. They might have found themselves in a similar situation at some point. You're not going to be the first person to make a fuck up at work, and you're not going to be the last person. And the thing is, you look at it in the grand scheme of things. Yeah, okay, so you've, you've cost 12 grand. But then there are people in different, com uh, different companies that have cost the companies millions and millions of pounds. Now, I appreciate it doesn't help your situation out, don't get me wrong. But, there are people that have done far worse shit than you have. Uh, I went to professional with my fucker uh, and advice. Just keep your mouth shut. And there is a plan to tell him next month. Oh, right, okay. That's the thing. If you've gone to somebody else who's, who's in the industry or professional who's noticed it, and they've said, look, we're formulating a plan to do, to, to tell this guy, then yeah, if, if you've got somebody sort of higher up or somebody who knows that industry more than I do, then yeah, make a plan. But for the love of Christ, don't fucking do yourself a disservice by doing it. Eh, we'll collect that. Uh, let's quickly... Again, see if they'll join... Love a good cover-up. Well, I'm convinced that Elk is actually a member of the Men in Black, so... That guy is 27 years in the business, so I trust him. Oh, yeah. There are people like that that are worth their absolute weight in gold. Uh, okay, that way. Are you going left or right, dude? What's that? You're going... Oh, shit. Nope, oh, dead. Eat my explosive fire bow. When I can hit you. Got him. Uh, he made plan while I had a mental breakdown while hiding under the blanket uh, so he'd not see my face. He is a professional. So what you do now, Elk, then, is you study what he's doing. Learn from this. So should anything happen again, you don't have to hide under the blanket. You can turn around and go, look, you know, if somebody else fucks something up, you can go, look, okay, I know how to deal with this. Make it a learning experience. I prefer my grenade. Pulls everything together so we can shoot it all at once. Right. As this is hero, there's going to be more bad guys. I am not rushing the boss. Oh, wow. Whatever they just hit her with just... Fucking annihilated her HP. See guys, this is why we don't rush the boss, because you did. Nope. You've got...
No, it's not used the grenade there. That's a grenade. Oh, too valuable. We are going to save our super in case we get into trouble. Woo! Are we going to the dead dude over here? How about no, motherfuckers? Boom, she did. Ooh, and I've got a bond. Hopefully that's a high-level bond. Paris, it's over. Come on, I want a high-level bond. This is a relief to hear. But Hashladun's presence is no right. coincidence. So we're done here. The hive done must two have more quests. Ambitions for the pyramid. Yes, Elk, if if that guy can like get you out of trouble and make a plan on how to get it all sorted, I would suggest at least buying him a pint. Or several. Right. High level bond. High level bond. High level bond. Yeah, get in. Well, that bond that I fucked up earlier. There we go. It's all sorted now. That's on the uh, level it should be. Uh, da -da 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 -da. So, if I put my highest gear back on, what are we at? Uh, goes up, goes up again. So, we need primary, a helmet, a chest piece, and a bond. And we've got everything at max level. Yeah, it's looking pretty, pretty funking good at the moment. Uh, and claim. So that one. Yeah, we've got a thing. Kind of looks like a hand cannon or a sidearm. Pardon me. Ooh, what was that? It's terrible. Uh, back in a tick, just making a hot chocolate. Ooh. With little marshmallows and floaty caramel bits. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know why, but as I said that, I did the hand movement of, like, dropping, almost like Salt Bay and such, dropping stuff into the, uh, that guy is my father. Ah, okay. Uh, so far, I promise that I'll be a good girl and also go without a beating, so, uh, so that is good. I guess I have to buy him a, a, a few good cigars. Yeah. But that's the thing, Alk. At least he's there to back you up. If he knows the business and he's backing you up, fair play. Um, I'm going to keep hold of that. All right, okay. Oh, we got other shit in here. I would say, so apart from that, Alk, how's your day been? But I imagine that that has somewhat dominated most of your day. Oh, uh, bungee seal pin available. Oh, oh, I've earned the serif pin. Okay. Only players who have the uh, pres uh, fuck sake perseverance against the most difficult foes in your dedication to the most challenging adventures have unlocked this. Surprisingly, I did. Mm. <laughs> I, I, I. Uh, I, I imagine that it, uh, it kind of took up most of your day there. But Elk, you are here. You, you can vent. You can talk to us. You can have a laugh and a giggle and say, Oh dear Lord, I feel I feel like a, a nincompoop. I have done something incredibly silly. And we will go, Yes, you have. You've done something incredibly silly. But did you learn something from it? That, that's the most important thing, Elk. Did you learn something from this? Uh, masterwork piece of armor. Any piece of armor will do, I guess. How much do we need for this? Oh, I've still got some more. But they, they're going to release more tomorrow, so... Definitely need to check my work after me. And make sure that you don't have fucking... Um, 
um, ba -ba -da -ba -da, purchase orders or invoices bunched together. That's good. What? Oh, tangled in cables. Fight the cable death. Right, so we've got to do two heist battlegrounds, focus and engram, specific engram. Trials of Osiris. Mm, that would be happening. Uh, we got to do Gambit. Got to do Grandmaster Nightfall. Uh, complete Crucible matches in the competitive. Okay, so we can do Crucible. We've got to do Crucible. Uh, momentum control. Team score. Got either of those on today? Uh, we have team scorched. Right, let's go do some PvP. I'm not the biggest fan of PvP because I suck ass at it. So, but fuck it, we'll do some PvP. Uh, this I won't forget until my death. See, that's fine. You've learned from it. That's that's all that matters. Because I can almost guarantee there'll be a couple of things you'll learn, Elk. You'll have learnt to uh, double-check everything, if you can. Um, you'll have also learnt to triple-check everything. Um, possibly have somebody else to look at it just in case you've got a blinkered view, because I've done that before. Or I've looked at something that I fucked up. Uh, at work, what they miss? Um, you yeah, haven't missed a lot. Uh, Elk is going to be uh, on the chicken. For a while um, because it's what she can afford um, but I did turn around and say at least she can afford a chicken um, Americans can't afford eggs at the moment Gale Prime I return um, we have completed a couple of things we're now going into Team Scorch on Destiny 2 which means we all get really big explosive cannons and we all blow the fuck out of each other and I suck at PvP so I'm gonna die No marshmallows. What about floating caramel bits? Yeah, in the UK, um, we, we we went to the shop earlier for 15 eggs, and these are large free-range eggs, were £2.25. So you're looking probably just over $3. Does cat hair count? Um... I can see I can't really say anything considering that every time My world Every time I make a drink, you know, I, I end up with dog hair in it somewhere. And that is what happens when you own a very, very fluffy dog. No! I can't hit him! I'm shit! <laughs> I told you I suck at crucible. I fucking told you. I had fucking two free shots on the dude and I missed them both. Oh, yeah. Do you know what? I don't think we're going to be playing Team Scorch very long because we can't fucking. We can't hit anything. Oh, we, we struck him! Oh, no. Too close to the wall. We killed him. Why, why am I. Oh, they spawned me on the other end. Okay. Anybody over here? No? All hiding out over there, are we? Okay. Ah, world! Wow! That dude just got me out of mid-air. What a shot. There's just explosions all over the place, and most of them are me blowing up. Oh, there's a dude right underneath me. Go fuck yourselves! <laughs> I've not got a single kill. I fucking suck at this. 
Oh, we're all coming around that side, are we? Five minutes remaining. Oh, come on, I hit a dude. Longest streak, none. Anybody watching this is going to come in and go, Right, okay. This dude, let's just see how this streamer uh, does in Destiny PvP. Oh, he doesn't. He absolutely fucking doesn't. Then, like, nobody... Oh, yeah, you're over there now, are you? Okay. Morning, gents. Oh, yeah, goodbye. Fucking about three of them. Uh, thanks to whoever gifted me the sub. That would probably be Cags. Because Cags is one of my lovely, lovely moderators. Shoot all the things. I'm trying! <laughs> I'm desperately trying to shoot all the things. No! I got one! I... <laughs> Never mind. That was one very short hit. <laughs> Just ran into that dude. Uh, I did no such thing. Show me proof. I can't show you proof. It was dedicated. It was donated by anonymous. There's got to be somebody over here. There's got to be somebody over here. Don't let your enemy. Really, Shax? Out of all the people you're telling to not let the enemy take this out of fight, you're telling me. Well, I traded, I got another gun on the one. Problem with Team Scorch is it's so easy. Ooh, we got that dude. We got two! Got fucking two, chap. Three minutes. Um, yeah, it's so easy in Team Scorch to get into CQB. We got three! <laughs> <laughs> it's so easy to get in CQB and just pay the price for it because they don't have to hit you, they just splash damage you. Oh dear lord, yeah, we're rocking it now. We got four. Nope. We have a kill streak. Seriously. I got eight. I got eight in a row. I do not believe <laughs> from the start of that match where I completely fucked it. I managed to get eight in a row. Where did I come? Okay, I, I got two assists, apparently. Got the longest streak out, streak out of everybody. Nice. Um, so tell me what I have done well today. You have not had a heart attack, Elk. You have successfully managed to navigate the day when I would have had a heart attack. Streaking out of his mind. No, the last time I had a streak that good was when I went across a, uh, a golf course with no clothes on. <laughs> Some people call him the streak. I said, what have you done well? I did my interview well, I feel. I think I did my interview really, really well. I think that's... Uh, whether I get it is a different thing, but I think there is no more I could have given in that interview um, than what I, I gave. I think that is going to be the best shot I've got. Knowing my luck, knowing my luck, I'll get offered the position... And it'll be, yeah, amazing. And they'll go, yeah, but we can't afford to pay you anymore. It'll have to be um, £30,000. And it'll be that moment going, he's eh. <laughs> dropping five grand. Sorry, dropping five grand a year. And then I'm going to have to travel on top of that. So it means, hmm. Uh... I do render art. AI created imagery. I have zero drawing capability. 
I mean, see, see, Gail and uh, and Cag, you'll be able to talk to each other because you do different styles of artwork. So it, it it's still two artists. I managed to stay awake this long. Well done, Ice. Ice, I believe in you. I, be I believe you can stay up later. I've got full faith in you. I'd love to see some of your work sometime. Um, with your permission, Gail, I can certainly um, guide Cag to your work. Or in fact, I could tag her on uh, tag her on Facebook to see your work. But that's only with your permission, because obviously I don't know. Don't know if you want Cag knowing all of your details. Nah, Instagram has more. Ah, fair enough. Well, I, I do trust you, sir. So if you want to put your Instagram post in the chat, then feel free to do that. Your Instagram page. I don't know. I don't have Instagram. I do AI pod. Sweet. There you go. I you can put yours in there as well. Prime underscore generations is, is my user. Yeah, Ice, if you want to put yours in as well. See, we're a community. We're, everybody's different. Everybody offers a little bit. I can't draw or do artwork for shit. I can sell you shit. I could probably sell you a little turd. It's how special it is. It's gold plated and everything. But... <laughs> I can't draw to save my life. Can you remember the old... Um, was it Draw With Me? So a little, a little game on your phone where you draw a picture and somebody else that you were playing with had to guess what it was. And they had a certain amount of letters. I always remember on that, I somebody um, I had to draw a cowboy. Um, so I basically drew a stick figure horse with a stick figure person. Oh shit, I got two. Nice. Fucking mean business on this game. Well, blood for blood. Yeah, I, I I had cowboy, so it was a stick figure stick figure man on a stick figure horse. And then I had um cowgirl. And it was a stick figure man on a stick figure horse with a dress. Oh sorry, with a skirt. Oh, I fluffed my jump, I was well too close to the ground. Some people call him the street. I like the fact I actually got away with that street comment. I'm quite proud of that. Boom, you're dead. Oh, you you just murdered that guy that I was going for, that's fine. Oh, a shot out of midair. What a shot. Away from keyboard. Yep, no problem, Elk. I wonder if that game's still going. The, um, the, the little drawing game. Oh, God, that was terrible. I'm going to die. Oh, did I? No, no I didn't get it. I thought I got it, dude, because of the noise. No, I certainly didn't get him. Because I know on my phone now I've got the, the little game, I think Ellen DeGeneres played it on her show. Where um, you put your phone on your head. And people have to either describe or mime um, what, what the word is on your head. And then if you get it right, you tilt it down and you get a point. If you, get it, uh, if you pass, you tilt it up and it goes to the next one and you've got 60 seconds to do as well as you can. I have no games on my phone. I, I had I have that one. I have the Destiny 2 app so I can transfer um, stuff from my vault to my character. Because that's just such a useful little app. Um, and I have Sudoku. Boom! Got him. 
Oh, I, I got murdered. Wall. No, uh, I wouldn't say that I'm, I'm completely dying in this one. I'm at least holding my own a little bit. Oh, fuck that up though. Get him on the second time round. I've realised now that winning this game is about pure fucking patience. It's not just firing, it's just waiting for people to hit solid ground. And trying to get them with the, the splash damage as such. Quite sure how I survived. Never mind. <laughs> I have a calculator that lets me write boobies on it. <laughs> Fuck it out. It's been a long time since I've seen anybody do that. Ah, but the thing is, you can tell where you've got a, a true calculator because you can write boob lusts on it as well. Oh, uh, that was close. Never mind. That's supposed to spell boobies? Yes. It's how you write boobies on a character. Uh, on a character. On a calculator. The enemy has almost won. Oh, that sucks to be you, dude. Sucks to be me, dude. I actually can't see what score is because my little streaming thing that shows that I'm online is actually over the score. Some people call him the streak. Fuck that shot up. Well, I hit him, but I didn't kill. Oh, did it again. Nope, that's that's definitely me dead. Have you never seen that on a calculator, Elk? Have you never seen somebody write boobies? I mean, that was one of the things we did back in fucking like primary school. I mean, Jesus. When we were in like year seven of high school, we, we did that because we were all immature still. I mean, hell, I'm still immature. Actually, me and, me and my wife now, um, we have boobies as part of our phone etiquette. Because I'm basically tech support, um, anytime... Woohoohoohoo! Took him out of midair. Ooh, got blown out of midair too. Anytime I... Anytime she has a technical issue, um, she just phones me up. Uh, it's like, you're right. how you doing? And she just goes, boobies. And it's like, okay, right, tech support mode engaged. What's wrong? So I don't know what it is. We've just decided that the word boobies is the, the code word for I need tech support. Jeez, I'm top of the team. Fuck out, something wrong there. My batteries are low again? Okay, now. Just started playing. Right, while it loads us into a new game, I will quickly change my batteries. Oh, bollocks. Right, we're back. We're back. We're back. We're back. Get back into that. We're actually not doing too badly on getting that mission done. Um, will that work if I rig up PC World and ask for assistance? Um, Possibly. Shout boobies down the phone at them. It might do. You never know. If I was working at PC World, it would work, wouldn't it? I suppose the thing is, would you shout boobies down the phone at, you, at them? I mean, let's say your printer wasn't working. I mean, yeah, it's an annoyance, but it's not like the end of the world, so it's just going to be, hello, PC world. Ah, <sighs> boobies. You know, you're just pissed off. But, I mean, if your laptop is, like, on fire and you need to save the files on it and, you know, you're, you're absolutely freaking out, you can, like, phone, hi, PC world, boobies, boobies, boobies. <laughs> Oh, God, what has my stream become? Do you know what my stream has become? It's become fun. 
Yeah, that's the point. What was that bloody game called where you put the phone on your fucking head? While I'm loading into a game, I can spot it. Uh, it's called Heads Up. It's a good little game. Also, chat, do I go and watch the ice hockey on Saturday? Now, I would like to point out to anybody who's who's just joined the chat and said, oh, Wolfie likes ice hockey. This is British ice hockey. This is not like the American ice hockey. So it's, it's, it's slightly different. When I say slightly different, it's basically you don't have the grandeur for it. We don't we don't have as much money spent on ice hockey in the UK. But do I go see the ice hockey on Saturday chat? That is the question. Is there cake? Um uh no there's not cake there is a restaurant oh sorry there's a, no they've got like a little restaurant that does burgers hot dogs chicken strips fries um there is a papa john's at the other end um there is a bar that serves obviously beer um and bar snacks but i don't think there is cake it is in coventry so there's probably somewhere in coventry i can go get cake on a saturday uh, sounds too cold. It's... <laughs> stay inside. It's safer. Yeah, but... You see, if I went to see the ice hockey, it would be cold and safe. Well, I would be... I would be safe. The guys on the ice might not be. I will always remember the first ice hockey match we went to see. My wife bought the tickets because I'd always wanted to go see ice hockey. So we went to... Went and sat down in our seats and God knows what. And I'm sat there going, yeah, I, I, I love ice hockey. I watched it on TV loads. Love ice hockey. Boston Bruins are my my, my team. Um, and in the UK, it's the Coventry Blaze. Um, so we were sat down and I, I sort of looked at the missus. Well, I don't know if you're going to enjoy this or not. I You, you might do, you might not. I, I'm not sure. And we watched it and it was going going like really well, you know some really skillful play there was a couple of goals going yeah this is really going good and then a guy got checked up in, at the glass sort of right in front of us and he hit the deck got up his helmet went one way his gloves went another and all you saw was this other guy that checked him against the glass his helmet went one way his gloves went another the jukes came up and that was it then they were kicking the shit out of each other and I kid you not, no word of a lie, I was sort of sat there going, yeah, you know, we've all come for a fight. My wife was on her feet going, kill him, fucking hit him. And it's like, oh, Christ. It's like, yep, yeah, okay. The missus likes ice hockey, apparently. Any sort of blood sport will be fine. Uh, I'm going to go this way, and I'm going to get blown out my freaking shoes. Cannon. Come on, where are you? You're over there, are you? Uh, no. Ooh, not falling off the yeah I'm, I'm falling off the edge over here well at least nobody gets the kill for uh, or nobody gets the point for killing me because technically they didn't kill me I fell off the edge oh that dude got me though Elric got me damn you Elric see not doing very well in this one I've got no kills and we've just started I mean god I hit him, but I didn't kill. Oh, well, Elric just got melted. Oh, <laughs> come on. Uh, no then. Sound, uh, sounds like effort. I disapprove. Well, you know, there is a plus side to not go to the ice hockey, which if I don't go to the ice hockey means I can do other things on Saturday. It also means I save money. I have no idea if anybody's in there. I'm going to guess kind of not. Oh, bollocks! <laughs> oh, go on. Fall off the edge. Go on. Ah, oh, he fell off the edge, but I didn't count as hitting him.
Oh, didn't think I was going to get that dude. <sighs> nope. Five minutes. Five minutes remaining. Where are you hiding? Oh, I hit him, but I didn't kill. Hit that time. Oh, and bye world. Down. How? The, what? Gem Phoenix just murdered me. Oh, get on the edge! <laughs> I had to stop to mantle. Uh, being inside playing video games is my plan. Ah, but well, what are you playing? Well, it's a it's a uh, kill for a kill, but screw it. Where'd you go? Almost won. <laughs> blood for blood. Three minutes remaining. It just reminds me of the Simpsons. Blood for cream. Blood for cream. Well, fuck. I killed one dude and got murdered by another. Are you? Oh, you're coming around there. Nope. Boom. Murdered him. Not very many settings, to be fair. You can declare I murdered him. Ah, oh, I fight over his head and be rather happy about it. <laughs> Somebody's aiming at me. Probably that dude just there. That was a shot and a half. Fair credit. You're defeated. Fight again. Persistence. Yeah. Right, okay. How are we doing the quest? Guardians are measured by their ability to come back from defeat. We need to defeat eight more. Okay, eight more and we get that one done. Um jump. Right, so it's not not doing anything for that one. Okay, that's fine. At least in Team Scorched. You don't find uh, you don't feel like you've spent enough time to actually give a monkeys about the fact that you're not winning. Uh, it'll be a toss up between Monster Hunter, Hi-Fi Rush, and giving Age of Empires two console edition. Oh, or Ro Robo Quest? I've not heard Robo Quest. Thinking what what have I got left to play? So. Destiny 2, Minecraft, Stardew Valley, Phoenix Rising, Immortals, Persona 5, Royale, Dead by Daylight, Death's Door. Uh, there's always um, Frostpunk, Astroneer, Deep Rock Galactic, Back for Blood. The Hunter. The hunt is quite a relaxed one, even though you are running around hunting animals. It's quite a relaxed game. Um, oh, we have to do what the derp as well. We have to do what the derp. Ooh, Frostpunk, I like that game. Frostpunk's brilliant. I love Frostpunk. It took me so long to do a Frostpunk run with, with nobody dying. 
I think it was actually with your help, Elk, that I did the the, the run with no one dying. Because you went, no, if you don't want anybody to die, don't build that. Why? Because somebody dies if you build that. Oh, shit, sorry. Uh, RoboQuest landed today. Uh, it's on Game Preview on Game Pass. Ah, okay. Well, my Game Pass runs out tomorrow. Um, but the thing is, I um, you can go on to... Was it CD Keys? And you can buy a month's worth of Ultimate for like two pound seventy, but you can't you can't activate it while you have a subscription active. But it's that moment going. If I pay the regular subscription, it's ten quid. Oh, sorry, it was ten ninety nine a month. If I buy a card every month, it's two pound seventy. So it's like, hang on a minute, for four months. I can pay the same as what Xbox are asking me to pay for one month. The only difference is, is that every 30 days, every 31 days, whatever, I have to put in a new code, which isn't exactly that drastic. Let's see. Um, tell me when. My Game Pass subscription expires tomorrow. See, that's what gets me. It expires tomorrow. So is that going to be midnight tonight? Or, because it's Microsoft, are we working on a US time? So it's going to be 5 o'clock in the morning. Either way, I can turn around and go, look, I've got my code here. It's going to take me 30 seconds to put a code in. But for that 30 seconds, it means that I actually pay a quarter of the price for Ultimate. Which I think is a pretty good deal. You know, so it, if I say 30 seconds every month, that means that 12 months, it's going to take me six minutes. Six minutes I have to spend in an entire year to save... nine about, probably about 97 quid 97 quid a minute i think it's pretty good i've been a game pass ultimate sub for a good few years now yeah i did the um buy three years of gold and then pay a pound and transfer it all over to ultimate but they don't do that anymore now they do it you can buy three three years worth of gold and you can transfer it, and it will give you two years' worth of ultimate. What, gold's 40 quid a year, so 40, <clears throat> 40 80, 120. It was 120 quid for two years' worth of ultimate. So... Does that work out roughly five quid a month? Five times twenty-four. Yeah, it's hundred and hundred and twenty. Defeat your enemies. That's all I ask. Right, we need eight. This was the level we got an eight eight man fucking kill streak on last time. Blood, oh blood. Oh, I was waiting for the dude to land, but he got blown up. Oh, they're all getting blown up as I run towards them. He just came around the corner and just fucking annihilated me. I could not hit that guy with a fucking barge pole. Oh, I hit somebody, but I didn't kill. I don't think I've got... Oh, no, I've got a kill. I've got a kill, apparently.
Oh, come on. I need to get eight kills or at least get credit for getting hits. Bye, world. Um, did a full laptop wipe today so I can start playing things again, hopefully. Wipe as old apps. Oh, right, yeah, you've, you've cleaned all the... Uh, the old app's off. Depends what kind of games you play, Elk. I mean, you, you play Frostpunk. Gotcha. Oh, he got blown up, but not by me. Um... Oh, God, that's another one. Oh, missed him. Oh, yeah, I got that one as well. Nice. Okay, so we've, we've got a couple now. We've got about four. Cool, there's another one down. Brown, brown, brown. Another one gets blown up. And another... Oh, there's another one. Oh, we're going to die. We're miles outside of our, our fucking area. Yeah, we're dead. I think we might need one more. They've almost won. Ooh, it's a bit warm out here. Rock it up the bum. Choo -choo -doo. That's not what I want. Good effort, but nobody's home. What's that? Uh, it had a couple of profiles and loads of stuff on there I wasn't using, so you did a full factory reboot. I've done that on on several laptops. Oh, come on, I think I need one kill. Three minutes. Oh, no. Rise from this loss and fight again. I'm going to pet my wolf. No, they blew my wolf up. Measured by their ability to come back from right. defeat. So that. So stand. Fight. I want to have a look at my fucking missions, you bastard. Uh. Oh. We need a kill. I was right. We need a kill. Uh, battle net won't work, so we'll play with it tomorrow. Virtual doggo. Yeah, I have a. a oh, it's a virtual wolf. It's a virtual. Wolf. Um, hang on. If I go in that and then do that one. It's my little wolfie. Any whimpers and everything. I haven't logged onto my battle.net account in years. Um I only ever played uh da -da 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 Warcraft on it. And my, uh, my Warcraft character was called Trinvanite. And he was a Worgen Druid. And I don't know what it was. Something happened that I just went, Do you know what? I'm not paying for fucking for Warcraft anymore. Screw that for a game. Uh, I really need a massage. My uh, my back is really stiff. Any volunteers with a bit of skill? Wolfie. I have massaged my wife. I Apparently, I do give rather nice massages. However, one, I don't know how my wife would approve. Or if my wife would approve. And two, normally when I give massages, there are other benefits as well. So I would suggest running very fast. <laughs> Shiny doge! What have I actually got for my emotes? Uh, oh, yeah. Go sleep on the couch. Uh, oh, I've got my wings. And, oh, yeah. This is um, every time I end up playing Sea of Thieves. I turn around and my ship's on fire. <sighs> yeah. 
Oh, that's my character there with the lovely white horns. Which actually, the way that that helmet works... Oh, bollocks. I didn't want to cancel out a fucking gambit. Not gambit. Crucible. I've got one kill to get on Crucible, and then that bit's done. Um, yeah, the way that this helmet works... So, I have sort of those black feather bits, or that, that those black feather crown, all the time. But you've got the white light coming off it. That white light isn't there. As my super bar builds up and gets closer and closer to full, that white bar becomes brighter and brighter until I it's full and I actually have the top of my helmet shining. So I, I like, I think that's rather funky. Uh, it is where I'm going to play today. I haven't played it for a while. Oh, God, what was the last time I... The last thing I did... What was after Pandaria? There was there was a DLC after Pandaria, and you could create a... Like a, a I don't know, a fortress? A forest sort of fort? Um, and you could have, like, different... I don't know, different professions in there? Um, that was the one that I... That's, I started doing that one. I went all the way through the legendary item quest line, which was for a ring. Um, I got the ring, and I just went, yeah, I'm fucking not bothered with Warcraft anymore, and I just exited. And I've never played it since. I really want to try Elder Scrolls Online now. It, uh, now it's all free on Game Pass. Apparently it's a very good game. I've never played it, but apparently it's a very good game. Uh, so with Massage, I need to go to Cags. Uh, you, you can go to me... It's just probably safer to go to Cags. <laughs> or you can ask Dodge. Or if you want, I can ask Pixie for you. See, this is the one thing you'll find about my stream, is that we, we don't mind taking the piss. Everything is... Up for a giggle. Oh, I missed him. I don't want to die by your wife's hand. <laughs> I, again, my wife wouldn't kill you. She'd kill me. She'd kill me, and then not only would she... Good shot, Autobahn. Not only would she kill me, she would... Um... At my funeral, she'd probably play um, Cool and the Gang, Celebrate. So, you know, as my uh, as, as the as the priest is going, and here lies Wolfie, he has passed away, he has gone. Now some music to remember him by. And then all you'd hear is, Celebrate good times, come on! <laughs> I've already said, when I die... Fucking I could. Yeah, I finally got him. When I die, I want somebody to show up to my funeral dressed um, like I was when I was uh, when I was like, like I am the age now when I was slightly younger, um, and I want them to come running in at the back of the funeral and just shout, "Wait, wait!" and basically have people go, "What?" Just go, "I'm Wolfie from the past." Right, this is going to take a lot of explaining, and then just to smile and walk out. Ah, bloody. Seriously, get a massage from a woman is uh, from someone is hard. Usually, uh, those people will try to fuck you. So I, I need someone without those intentions. Yeah, but you see, that's the thing. If I ask Pixie to give you a massage and Pixie agrees, then I feel Pixie is probably more at risk than you are. Because I get the feeling you'll jump, Pixie. I got a kill and I died. No, but this is one of the things. This is why I'll always, I'll always make jokes about sex and and penises and boobs and I, I make jokes about all of those things because the amount of people that sit there and go, you can't possibly talk about that. You can't possibly say anything about that. Why? Oh, well, you know, it, it's, it's just one of those things you don't talk about. And it's like, look, the fact that you are here and you are talking about it means that somebody had sex, didn't they? 
And it's like, yeah, but you don't go talking about it in public. Why not? To be honest, there's a shitload of people that talk about sex in public. You talk about it with your friends. You talk about all sorts of different shit. And yet, you can't say it to random strangers because, oh, you don't know what's going to happen. You know what? Most people talk about exactly the same things. They just don't admit it. And that's the that's one of the most hilarious things I find about this world. Can't possibly talk about sex because sex is only between uh, only between partners in the bedroom. Really? <laughs> I assure you, it's not. I assure you, there's a whole fucking group of people that don't do it in the bedroom. We're British. We can't talk about that. No, being British doesn't mean we can't talk about sex. Being British means that we're good at a, we're good at a couple of things. We're good at complaining, and we're good at queuing. Um, and it also means that no matter what the temperature is, we have to have a sheet on us when we're in bed. The only bad result is a tie. Don't be discouraged. I'm not discouraged. I'm just leaving Crucible forever. No, we've done the mission, so we don't need to go in Crucible anymore. Um, if he keeps quiet while doing the massage, it won't be a problem. I know his voice. I don't know if he's a handsome boy or not. Um, oh yeah, definitely, and only after marriage. <laughs> yeah, of course. There are so many people out there that um, only ever have sex in the bedroom and only after them uh, after they're married. They, they never do anything else. I sleep on top of the sheep's in the summer. Now, Ice, you've opened up a doorway here, and I have to ask this question. And feel free not to answer. Feel free to tell me to fuck off. All right. You sleep on top of the sheets in the summer. Do you sleep naked on top of the sheets? I stone bonkingly guarantee you, as a British person, if you sleep on top of the sheets, you do not sleep naked. Uh, I absolutely do need a sheet on when I'm sleeping, even when it's 40 degrees. But I have four fans on me. Yeah. Four fans, seven ice packs, three, um, three aircon units. Uh... With knickers on. See, you're not naked. There was there's an old comedian, um, Lee Hurst, and he he talked about Br uh, being British, and he said the thing about being British, he said you will lie underneath the covers completely naked, right? So you're you're in bed, complete naked, covers on you. It'll be sweltering hot, and you'll go, I'll take off the duvet, okay. I'll take off the top sheet, okay. I'm still fine. I'll take off the blanket. No, no, I'm still too warm. I'll take off the bottom sheet. And at the moment you remove that bottom sheet, you're sat there going, no, I'm British. I'm in bed. I'm completely naked. No, I need that bottom sheet. And the bottom sheet comes back on or underwear goes on or pyjamas go on. There is no British person I know that sleeps on top of the covers completely naked, no matter what temperature it is. On the flip side of the coin, it's not like I've been out in the middle of the street with a clipboard going, just a quick question, sir and or madam. Do you sleep completely naked in the summer? Uh, we need to be high spark grounds. Um, we really got a de uh, dehumidifier. will be interesting to see what the heat does. During the sticky summer, I I'm the room I'm sat in right now, my living room. I have a, de a small dehumidifying unit right in front of me. It's not on. It's just that's kind of where it lives because when the dogs get warm, we turn the uh, dehumidifier on, put it on uh, ice cold, and just literally blitz the dogs with it. Uh, by the way, big question on everyone: when you sleep and you have a dream about someone, uh, and it's really nice dream. For example, you're crushing on that person. When you wake up. Are you trying to fall asleep really quickly to hope on catching that person? Um, so, yeah, what, what you're saying, Elk, is do you try to fall asleep really, really quickly to carry on that dream? Um, I can't say I have, although... Shit, my fucking thing's set up wrong. Although recently I've had a weird thing where I had a dream um, and basically I was in like a... It was modern day, I'd like to point out, in the dream. Um, however, I'm in like an old school, like, Victorian style mansion that's really, really nice. Um, and But there, there's like weird and paranormal shit going on in the mansion. Um, and 
for probably about three months now, I, I'll have a dream about this fucking mansion and then it'll just like fade away into my memory and then like a month later, I'll have a dream that I'm back in that mansion. Completely different scenario, but the mansion's exactly the same. Um, and I just keep dreaming about the same fucking mansion that I've made up in my own head. And it's like, what the fuck? I, I spoke to Kag about it. I said, I think I'm going to start calling it my mind mansion. But no, I have no idea. I have no idea where this mansion came from. But yeah, I just start dreaming about this fucking mansion. I would really like to have my fucking grenade back, please. Uh, you boys are dead. Right. We have one grenade. Give me some fucking enemies and we're going to start making shit turn purple. Right, you guys are nearly finished on that one, so... Right, Give me my grenade back. My weaken, blow... Fucking bad guy out of the sky. Your shield only works if I can't see past it. Alright. He's dead. It all blows up! Look at all the lovely particle effects. Um, I made a I made a game in my sleep. It's a dice game. Ah, but see now the question is, have you brought the dice game into reality? Uh, I have three whole universes which I dream I usually dream about. No, I just have a mansion. I'm not quite sure why. Not quite sure what what relevance this mansion is, but. Uh, I lay in bed, my vision fades, it goes to black, and I wake up the next day. Damn, what you've got there is called sleep, and I believe you've perfected it. That is weird, but it happened to me once or twice. <laughs> I'm a weird person. Yeah, he really is. He really is a weird person. Uh, let's put that down. All right. Wish the bad guys goodbye. Boom! Now you blow up. Throw that down there. Nope. Nope. Can't hit the side of a fucking barn. Come on, I need to kill something with my grenade. Get my devour. Never mind. To kick back in. Uh. Ooh. Alright, let's go to a res. Alright, let's clear some of these dudes out. That's the point. I haven't put my black talon on in ages, so I must, uh... If I get a piece of, uh, weaponry good enough, I'm gonna upgrade my black talon, so I miss that weapon. Hi, Scarlet! How you doing? Welcome to the chat. Hope you're doing alright. Um... Elk, usually I'm drunk or I have a good amount of Xanax in me. Okay! I'm good being a Celeste addict. Oh, is that the one where you have to climb the um, climb the the mountain? Always reminds me of like Super Meat Boy. It's that sort of. We'll need 
It's Protoson's favourite activity. I've completed Celeste. Uh, but I, I didn't get all of the strawberries. I certainly didn't get all of the tapes. Um, and... I, I feel I feel incredibly disappointed in my performance when you go and watch speedrunners do Celeste because they just make it look so fucking easy. I remember swearing at that game. 5,000 hours on Celeste. Jesus. I think I've probably got 5,000 hours on Destiny 1 and 2 combined. Oh, you are a Celeste speedrunner. So you're one of those people that makes me feel inadequate on that game. I sit there going, I've completed the first level. I'm so happy. And you're sat there going, first level? I've completed the first world. I'm on, I'm on like the cable cars. Oh, I'm going to explode. <laughs> oh. Everything is purple. No, I'd, I'd love to be able to speedrun certain games. I don't think I'd speedrun Celeste. Um, I don't think that would be my choice. However, it takes some freaking skill to speedrun that game. Grenade! Everything's blowing up. Oh no, I didn't have my rocket launcher fucking loaded. Open sesame. Uh, no, I completed the first Grandmaster Heart side. How many times has this facility changed? I uh, spent this morning to learn the, the core hyper and core super. Nope, nope, didn't even get to the core. I have no idea what you just said. I know of the core. But I've never, never got all of the, the pieces to unlock the door. Oh, shit. You know what? There's a wall there. That turns out that's one of the deadliest things for these warlocks. Find a core block, grab it. Anybody that speedruns Celeste and says it's simple. I can barely do Celeste on normal, never mind speedrunning it. I envy speedrunners that can do it like that. It's like the guys that do, um... Oh, fucking Dark Souls. And go, oh yeah, you can complete the entire game of Dark Souls in like three minutes using these glitches. And it's like... What? I, I can't even complete the first boss in three minutes. Never mind the entire pissing game. I think the only thing I ever speed ran was Sonic 3 and Knuckles, and that was about the first two levels. Because Sonic 3 and Knuckles is absolutely... One of my favourite games ever. I am going to die. Let's put that out there. Oh shit, I have no barrier on. Oh, he got his barrier back up before I could kill him. But now though. This is the kind of person that gives birth and does not hurt and give birth another three hours. There are some women who can do that. You can just go, yeah, it's not a problem. I, uh, birthing pain, yeah, not an issue. See, women don't seem to understand exactly how much men suffer during, uh, during birth. I mean, we have to then suffer broken fingers. We have to suffer being called a bastard. We have to... Uh, I'm not gonna we have to be told that it's all our fault. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it might be right, but... A protogen giving baby sounds like a bad idea. 
It depends. Depends who you're giving babies to. Right, I'm just being silly. I'm just... Oh, being silly with wordplay. Uh, how about no, you motherfuckers can die. Eat my grenade! Oh yeah, Charlemagne. We're in Charlemagne. Eat that. Go, 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 go! Right, if this works right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw my Nova Bomb. He's going to do that, and I'm going to get my Nova Bomb straight back. Yeah, look at that. Throw it again. Oh, he disappeared. Shit. All right, okay. Luckily, my grenades are set up to uh, try and get my abilities back really quick, including my Nova Bomb. Nope. How about go fuck yourself? You're not killing me today. I'd like to launch my grenade, please? Thank you. Oh, my devourer didn't kick in. Shit. Oh, thank you. Uh, just going to read chat and I got revived. Uh, I, I'm not ignoring you, chat, honest. I'm just trying to survive this bit. Uh, can I pick up the item, please? Thank you. Go. Right, stop eating my grenade throwing inputs. No! <laughs> Alex! Um. I have an easy answer for that. I've replaced children with cats. I've replaced children with dogs. Uh, easier life. After forming a core hyper, you'll be expected to form an unchained ultra dash into a demo dash? Dude, that sucked. Uh, well, usually guys are the problem, which gets us to the labor room, so of course you guys are blame. Old fudge, I've got a terrible hiccup. Whoever is thinking of me, please stop. See, now, Elk, you say that. <laughs> Congratulations. Now you can hypercore. Sorry, core hyper. See, Elk, you say that guys are the problem. However, I, I've seen a, a lovely comic, which I actually thought was really good. It's um, it's a woman giving birth, um, and her husband's there, and she's looking at him shouting, You bastard, you did this to me! And he looks at her really stern and goes, No, I think you'll find I wanted to do butt stuff, but you said that would be far too painful. And the next thing is you've got him and the doctor high-fiving. And it's like, really? <laughs> Fucking really? Uh, unless the one who's thinking of me is Pixie. Then continue. Ooh, get out of there before I die in the animation. Right. Clear out a bit of space there. It's looking a little crowded. Don't like it. Turn a couple of things purple. Earn my grenade back really quickly. Every time I kill something with my grenade, my Nova Bomb, or my charged up melee, I get an ability called Devour back. And Devour is every time I kill a bad guy, while Devour is active, I get a full health bar back. Cool, we're done. Right, so we need to do one more of these, and that completes another mission. Uh, this is why Celeste. Hit, this is why Celeste takes 14 buttons at top level. But it usually takes seven. I, suspect that's what she I you could give me a hundred and seventy-eight. No, in fact, tell her, like you could give me like buttons that, that the size of drums that you could hit, and I'd never be able to complete um, Celeste in any anywhere near a speed run of time. I want to. I, I want Celeste. Celeste race. Isn't there a whole speed running community for Celeste? 
that they, they do races and stuff and they show up on um, Games Done Quick. Doing butt stuff all the time will make us shit ourselves in old age. Um, as far as 15 years before it happened naturally. So please keep us some decency. <laughs> now, Elk, in response, in response, is that not what butt plugs were made for? Clues kind of in the name. I have a funny idea. Who will win? You with a proper controller or me with DDR dance mat? I love DDR. I haven't done DDR in ages, but I love DDR. Way you, Captain Jack. Way you, Captain Jack. Left, right, left. Left, right, left. A military step. Oh, God, I haven't played that game in ages. I actually have two proper DDR dance mats for the old PlayStation 1. And I have the, get, I have the home edition of it. I did not understand right now what is that. Right, <clears throat> Elk, you said having having lots of anal sex will make you poo or will make you shit yourself way earlier than you you should normally. However, is that not what butt plugs are made for? Now, in case you don't know, a butt plug is a sex toy which is inserted into thine anus and it plugs the butt. <laughs> I'm okay at speedrunning, not GDQ level, but good enough for the occasional national record too. Sweet! Hey, you've got to start somewhere. And be, being good enough to get national level or two is not just starting somewhere, that's look at the progress I've made. Oh yeah, well I believe that is not their primal use. Now you say it's not their primal use, Elk. But what happens if they get used for that more than for sexual pleasure? Surely their primal use will change. Horses? Ooh. Horses were not primarily for... Um, for pleasure. For, for, for you know, just riding as a, a casual day-to-day -day thing. Horses were a mode of transport. But... I would suggest there's a hell of a lot more cars on the road than there are horses now used for transport purposes. And I, um, when I say transport purposes, I don't mean for literally like a leisure ride. I mean actually transporting cargo from one place to another. Before anybody turns around and goes, I think you'll find, Wolfie, when you ride a horse, it is technically transporting you. So now we're comparing horses to butt plugs. I think it's a fair comparison, because I'm fairly confident that if you speak to Dodge, Dodge will be able to t tell you whether you can get a horse-shaped butler. Or horse-sized butler. Again, I asked this question that I asked earlier. Exactly what has my chat become now? <laughs> it's become fun. We have a giggle. I'm going to shoot you with a rocket launcher. I'm also going to blow the fuck up. <laughs> I had one second before I blew up. Oh, I didn't reload it again. It's alright, we'll just blow him out of his shoes. You still here? Not anymore! That did it. Serif tower disabled. Your chat has dissolved into horny insanity. I, I... Yes and no. Uh, I I would certainly agree with the insanity part. But, I worry we are missing but uh, the horny bit, that's that's just us taking the piss. I, I love making sex one of the topics to talk about and take the piss out of. Again, because people go, no, you can't possibly talk about that. Oh, we're going to talk about that. Why? Oh, because it gets a reaction. I've often said on this channel, um, I'm still trying to convince loads and loads of people to do it. If you ever get into a fight or somebody challenges you to a fight, all you do is start start undoing your belt, drop your trousers, start taking your top off. And when they go, what the hell are you doing? You just look at them and go, this ain't the first time I fought naked. And all of a sudden everyone goes, yeah, fucking leave him alone. He's a fucking weirdo he is. And it's like, yeah, weirdo that won the fight, I'd like to point out. Mm-hmm. <laughs>
Um, this has been an odd tangent tonight. Tangents are fun. I will take the piss out of everything and anything, including myself. Because, let's be honest, if you, if you look at the world in the right way, everything is so fucking negative that you just need to come and have an hour of fucking weird, silly, ridiculous, stupid shit. So everyone can have a laugh and a giggle and forget about the uh, the worries of life. Uh, I wonder if a butt plug could be a butt plug controlled Celeste. What, you have to clench to make a jump? Surely it would have to be like a butt plug and then like monitors or something on the hips. So when you clench, she jump and then you swing your hips left and right and she'll then jump to the left or right. It's not going to be too long before we start singing the, the um, bad touch by the Bloodhound Gang. All right, are you still over there? Yes, you are. Drop that bad boy down there. Oh, that was a shit grenade throw. That was far too fucking short. Okay, take it back. We just about made it. Hack in progress. Coming back from over there, eh? No, devour, kick it. Yes. <laughs> like Christ for that. Giant spear. Bye, everybody. I oh, got a couple of kills, not very many. Pointing. Oh well. Appreciate this bad guy underneath me. Are we going to get any like loads come out of this door? That would be really, really nice. Oh, you're all coming out of that door. Right, I will re-chat again in just a moment, uh, once, once we've finished blowing this room up. Oh, I've actually got items I can collect over here. Which is really, really useful, because it makes makes the hack go quicker. Right, the hack is complete. Right, let's have a look, let's have a look. So where was I before? Uh... Believe me, you are one of the explosive diarrhea from changing your opinion. Hornier than Satan's exploding ass crack trench from a frozen ice cream and a happy meal. <laughs> Boobs! What's the funniest, most creative insult you've ever come across? Oh, I don't know. I See, I've been called so many insults. I don't actually know... What am I doing? We'll pick that up. I think one of the best ones I like is um, if you're going to talk out of your ass, at least stand up because I just cannot stand fucking mumbling. And I, I don't know why I've always liked that one. Uh, Cockwomble. Oh, insults were uh, comparing Czech insults to the English one. Yes. Yeah, we were. Oh, is everyone... Everyone's going to stand around. I'll just kill you all, I guess. Right, so you've gone off that way. You've gone off that way. Do realise, guys, one of you could have literally grabbed the one above the door, but... How about no? You're all dead. You see previous comment. You're all dead. Uh... For me, it was when a keyboard reviewer I was watching hated the keyboard so much, he called it an exuberant uh, edelon of anthematic <laughs> enmity. 
with an immense caliber of fucking comparable to a stunt diver's balls. That's um That's certainly one of them. I I can say, yeah, I've not heard that before. Go on, I'll revive you then. Anybody who thought you were like a member of my team or something. Right, we're going to have a load of bad guys spawn there. So we're going to try and hit them with a grenade. Right, you. Get over here! Big Lance! Alright, there's a few bad guys there. We'll take all those out. I have another grenade, why not? And we're supercharged again. Everything's going purple. Where's the boss? He's over there. Oh, he's running. <laughs> that was an explosive bad guy there. Shit. Thank you. Oh, the boss is nearly dead. I'll rephrase that. The boss is dead. Two galley rounds. Right. Sorry, chat. Again, I wasn't ignoring you. I was... Murdering that guy before he murdered me. Oh, you're curling up on the couch? I can do that. I was curling up on the couch next to Doom. Right, okay. We need to go to the postmaster. Um, oh, not balls, please. Recently we talked about how disgusting those long, saggy ball sacks are. Uh... I have too vivid an imagination. Uh, are you possibly trying to describe them as two marbles and a hiking sock? I would like to point out as well, Elk, as much as men may end up having long, long saggy ball sacks, the reason that old women don't wear bras is because if they sag low enough, they can tuck their nipples into their socks and, you know, it keeps it warm. <laughs> I don't know why, but as a kid, I was stupid good at Mario Kart Wii. I oh, see. I I was, God, I was a, I think I was like teenager when Mario Kart Wii came out. I remember playing Mario Kart sixty four, on uh, I was gonna say on the N sixty four. No, I I was gonna say yeah on the PvP levels, where you ended up having fucking three balloons on the back of your car. I love that game. Check 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 it out. By a canary will keep you. Get rid of that. Alright, we've got a lot of crap in our inventory that we don't need. Yeah, interestingly, for anybody who's watching, um, Bungie did uh, a massive update on Destiny 2. And the whole point of, or well, one of the main points of this update was. That when it happened, you weren't going to... If, you, if you'd if you hit um, a high enough level, you weren't going to get um, blue items drop anymore. Uh, you'd have purples, but you wouldn't have blues. So everybody sort of went, oh my god, that's going to be fantastic, because I end up with so many blues in my inventory that are all shit. God damn it. I'll keep them, because I'll, I'll put them in my Lunar Faction. Um, so people went, yeah, it's going to be absolutely brilliant. So Bungie did the update, um, and basically it deleted a shitload of the triumphs and achievements for the game. 
See, so they had to roll the entire game back. So you still end up with blues now. But we actually have, you know, the rest of the game back. Uh, how to recognize a Celeste player. Are they trans? Are they a programmer? They probably play Celeste. I've Again, I've played Celeste. I'm not trans or a programmer. I, I don't even... Fucking hell, I think the last programming I did was fucking Visual Basic in high school. And I didn't do very well at that either. I sucked at it. Um, man, I'm not an old woman, but uh, but I can put... I, I can put a can of Coke between my boobs and just put a straw in there. So let's see. Elk? You can put a can of Coke between your boobs with a straw and you can drink from it. I can write my name in the snow without a stencil. <laughs> Hello, Guardian. Welcome. There is some fucking weird and wonderful shit that goes through my mind. Oh! Oh, right, we've got a high-level Taipan. Let's find our Black Talon before we do anything else. I, I do miss using the Black Talon. Uh, for some reason, as a kid, I thought it would be more fun to learn Python programming than play video games. With Python programming, you could create video games. So I, I, I can understand that one. I, I again I think I did Visual Basic and I I created a red ball on the screen and I could make the red ball move up, down, left, right, and then it would disappear off the screen. I made a wall to stop it disappearing off the screen. And then the last thing I remember doing was I did it so if it went off the left of the screen, it would reappear on the right into a screen wrap. Well, with a straw for boba tea, I could probably do the very same. Yeah, but you see, you have to have extra equipment to write your name in the Snow Elk. I I have all of the equipment I need built on to write my name in the snow. <laughs> this is what the chat has become. It's just become fucking silly, and I love it. Uh, right, let's go see what I think... Oh, no, it's not fucking holiday. What's the name? Hawthorne. Let's see what Hawthorne's got. Oh, no, wait. Is it Hawthorne or is it time to go to Ada? No, it is Hawthorne. Okay. Um, One of my Celeste files is a thousand hours long. Jesus. I'm trying to think. I think, I think my Destiny 1... What can I do for you? Oh, no, wait. Hang on. I can't... I can't... can't say anything. On Destiny 1, one of my characters I'd spent 124 days playing. So yeah, that's that's what? 2,400 hours? On one character? You might have played that a little bit. Probably done the same on this one. Right, so we've just got a primary. So that's 90, that's 90, that's 90. All our weapons are 90. That's done. So we need a helmet. A chess piece and a bond. If we get those three, we max out our level then. Um, or I can write my name in the snow with yours. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what, Elk? That is an argument I have never heard as an answer for that question. You might be able to write your name in the snow, but I can grab your penis and write my name using your penis and your urine. <laughs> As long as you don't eat the snow after... Yeah, golden rule is you never eat yellow snow. Oh, wait. Uh, shit, Hawthorne still wants to see me? Hawthorne, I want a helmet, a chess piece, or a bond. Hey there. Oh, Crucible. Oh. Yeah. Oh, see, these are all 89. I don't need 89s. I need 90s. Catch you later. Catch you later. We got. Uh, we'll keep it because we'll level something else up with it. 
fighting. In fact, we'll level a, we'll level our hand cannon up with it. Not the biggest fan of hand cannons, but uh, where the fuck is my hand cannon? Oh, I'm on mm, I'm on my hand cannon. You knob. We're gonna get rid of the riptide. Oh no, we're not. All right, let's. We got anything on here I can pull off? Yes. I can probably take the manticore off there soon as well. Right, 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 right. Um. Checks we find ways where others stop. I agree you find ways where others stop. However, I think you might have a few funny looks if you just go up to the nearest random man who's having a piss in the snow and just go, excuse me just one moment, I'm going to take control of this situation and write my name. <laughs> I mean, yeah, fair credit if you've got the bravery to do it. Ah, oh, stretch and hydrate. Right. Oh. oh, fuck it out. <laughs> Stretch! Oh, my knee just went click. Oh, bollocks. Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh that was a bit fresh. And hydrate. Right, uh, I've got a lovely... I've got some Pepsi Max Cherry with a forkload of ice. Oh, my nom, my nom. It's been a few hours. That's very true. And uh, Cags will probably thank you for doing it because I keep forgetting to do that shit. Um, right. So where were we? What are we doing? Right. First of all, is there anybody else on? Oh, we have an Hibio, and Hibio he'll be on. Uh, we have Panda as well, but I haven't I haven't seen Panda play um, Destiny in a while. She's been playing other stuff. But we have an Hibio. He's going to join the. Hi, the Hibio! Have you included your audio? What's going on? It's already included. Yeah. Uh, Elk, in Hibio, is he here? Yes, he's just joined. I want in Hibio! In Hibio, you've been summoned to the Elk. Uh, <laughs> I don't know how to respond there, because it's just been a rough few days. I was going to say, right, well, at the moment, the conversation in the chat... Um, we've had all sorts of different funny and silly conversations. We've also had conversations about ball sacks, um, women's boobs sagging so much they can tuck them into their socks, um, uh, men being able yeah, to... Like, men being able like to I said, it's just been a rough few days. <laughs> so men being no, able to I found out uh, two days ago, um, one of my gaming buddies who... I've been playing Destiny with since uh, D1, passed away recently. I did see online you put a message on there, and I thought, I, I'm yeah. not, not going to push that one. I'll, I'll leave that one, because obviously, uh, I, I don't yeah, know who we... he was, and I, I feel incredibly uh, incredibly sorry for you, because it's just one of those things that cannot be helped, but still hurts like a yeah, motherfucker. Because, uh, yeah, because I actually started playing with him when the Crota Raid was brand new. So we're talking like a few months after Destiny came out. I say, Jesus, that that is a while back. Yeah. El Elka yeah. said, "How are you, cutie?" I'm hanging in there. So let me actually pull up your stream. Well, you know full well in Hibio that you you can uh, you can talk to us about anything. That's the whole point. Do a bit of gaming, get a little community going. We can all have a chat, a rant, a giggle de-stress, share the problems of life. Uh, I'm very sorry, Inhibio. I saw the post and I felt there was no no place for me to comment. That's what Alex just said. Yeah, like I said, it's just... It... I have a weird way of dealing with grief because I don't deal with grief very well. Like, I have to tuck myself away to deal with it. Everybody deals with it differently. Yeah. But you know, no, you can always come and talk to us, and uh, or if you don't want to, you can always just come and we'll we'll game. It's what we do. Yeah, like I said, I I have to tuck myself away to deal with grief because, like I said, I don't deal with grief very well. Like That's... if I deal with grief, it's I have to do it privately. 
No, that's that's, that's fine. Say it. there. I know other people that do that. That's not a problem at all. <laughs> Elk has just turned around right and said, "I can find a nice photo of boobs online and send it to you if it'll make you happier." No, I got Pornhub for that. <laughs> Thank you for the offer, though. Elk's got but, only um... fans, but she she doesn't know that she's got an only fans account yet. Elk, just ignore the blinking red light in your apartment. It's fine. In Hibio, I'll send you the link later, okay? <laughs> okay. But, um... Yeah, it's just... It's, it's been rough. Because he's only a few years older than me. So he's... I want to say a year older than you. I'm... 35? Yeah, I'm 36 this year. He's two years older than you. It's Pixie's agent. Yeah. I thought Pixie was 40-something. I don't know. Maybe he is. I, th I thought yeah. Pixie was... Oh, either way, he he's two years older than me. But, um... Yeah, he was 37, and... He leaves behind a 17-year-old daughter who's graduating high school this year. And it's just... This is... It's... It's really rough. I... I say this, and it's no disrespect... As rough as it's going to be for you, I would suggest you, <clears throat> pardon me, you need to be strong and show support for her. Yeah. I'm fairly confident you'd be doing that anyway, but uh, Pixie's yeah. 40? What the hell? I don't have, He might be 40. I think Pixie's a few years older than me, but I'm not sure if it's five years older than me. Yeah, because well, what I might actually end up doing is um, this weekend, uh, I might gather the old Ray crew who some of them I don't even talk to anymore because of just random bullshit and be like let's just do this for Quake yeah absolutely it's 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 one of those things that that's where you have the fond memories from so that's, yeah. that's where you make the memorial stand from no, I completely agree mm -hmm. And uh, since we actually have King's Fall in D2, I'll probably just message them and be like, let's do a King's Fall for Quake. Absolutely. I completely agree. Again, it's, it's, that, yeah, mo we... it's, it's that moment where you turn around and you go, look, guys, I appreciate that we may have had random bullshit go between us, but for one day, let's put this aside. Yeah. Because it was me, my buddy, Doc is surfing. Who's the one actually told me that he passed away? Um, uh, Kazi Dragon, who was really close with Quake, with um, Earthquake. He was the one that passed away. And Kazi actually saw him as like a brother, even though they weren't like blood related. They were just that close. Um, there was Enchanted Raven. Who I had a falling out with, um, and her husband, and then there was me, and then there was my but my college buddy Ben, who we would raid with. And since Quake was West Coast and we we're all East Coast, uh, we would get Quake in on a later run for a raid. See, this this is the thing that gets me is that there's a shitload of people that basically say. Oh, video game de uh, they desensitize you to all these different things, and you know you you just you get so used to all of this and uh, like, killing things and death and God knows what. It's like no, you don't seem to understand. We don't. We we play these games for fun. We play these games for strategy. We play these games. We make new friends. But mm -hmm. when when we lose, and when we lose people, and when we when shit goes south, we use these as an escape. I mean, what was it? The entire Destiny community came together for the... There was, was it the one guy who had leukemia that was a Destiny player? And he passed away, and loads and loads of towers, all basically the Guardians showed up at once, and they all launched um, flare guns. And it was that moment going, guys, this is what gamers do. If, if we want to make a tribute, we make tributes in games. That's how we do it. Well, I do know there was a couple different... Um... Um, things going on in one of the uh, meme groups, but like, hey, you know, my son, you know, passed away from this very specific cancer. Can we all just wear this, you know, a 
just this color for like the month. And I actually saw that color fairly often in a tower. Yeah, I was, even though it? a lot of people were like, "Oh, you know, it's not going to do anything." Da, 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 da. It's like, yeah, wasn't it like it was one of the not hurt you? No, wasn't it like one of the gold-based ones, or there was like a gold trim in it? There was a gold one. There was a pink one for I think breast cancer, which was the uh, the following month. I think there was a blue one, and I think that was really it. I saw it I remember, only happened for like a couple months. I remember seeing the gold one. Um, in Hippio, yeah. If you need anything, you can always talk to me. I'll do my best to be here. That's from Elk. Again, if you've not got the chat. Oh, thank you, Elk. Um, Elk, am I the youngest one here? Uh, Elk, how how old are you? And Ice, how old are you? I'll have a fight for the youngest here. But no, I'd say um, if you if you don't want to be in the chat or you want to play solo tonight, that's absolutely fine. If you want to run some strikes or run some crucible, or whatever, yeah, we'll we'll run whatever. I I don't mind. It's completely up to you. Yeah, I'm gonna save my crucible for tomorrow after the reset. Oh yeah, we're gonna have another set of um, things, aren't we? Iron Banner, yeah. Even though I already got all the stuff I need to. Arc. Let me ask you. I don't know. Stress test is built. Uh, Elk is 26. Uh, Gale Prime is 30, uh, 35. Yeah, because you're you were in the same year as me at school. So, Ice is nearly 36. See, I'm 36 mid year. So, yeah. So, Elk, you've got like 10 years on everybody by the time. Well, sorry, 10 years below everybody. You young whippersnappers. No, I, I can I can certainly understand where you're coming from about getting a team together and making a making a, a memory of it. I mean, yeah. If, if you go into No Man's Sky, um, the if you just, if you're the first person to discover a like a galaxy or whatever, you can name it. So mm -hmm. I think there is a a star system called Angelexo which I created, and inside there is, I think there are four planets, and each of those planets is named after one of my dogs. So as long as No Man's Sky runs, I will always have my dogs in that game somewhere in that universe. Um, and obviously my one dog has passed away, which she was my little gaming buddy. She was the one that literally sat on the arm of the chair while I played video games. I've got her on mm -hmm. some, some of the old streams. Um... It's that moment going, she's on there. So, you know, I'm more than happy to have her there. In a, in a weird way, on the Hunter, I, I shot a white wolf. Um, and I had it stuffed and put into my um, trophy house. Because she was a pure white husky, I'm sat there going, yep. So that, that one there is called Snowball, because that's my dog. Um, on that note, I'm off to bed as I saw old as you see. That's not a problem, Ice. Oh, and Gail's going as well. Yeah, have a good night. I hope we see you two again soon. Behave yourselves and don't do anything I wouldn't. Ow. Alright, where are the modifiers? Brawler? Oh shit, I can't stress test this build. Why is that? It's... I actually have a, um... An arc build now for, uh, with Liar's Handshake, and I need to, um... What's called Stress test it, because it's a pure melee build. Where I just melee, dodge, melee, dodge. Um, why don't we... Well, after this, then, why don't we do a couple of Sorrows Harbor or something like that? I'm oh, sorry, I threw a grenade. No, it's fine. There you go. Um, fuck, my neighbors make really bad noise all afternoon until now. I have no idea what they're doing. Does it sound like a wooden headboard hitting the wall repeatedly?
I'll take the Destiny 2 servers. Oh, come on. Really, Destiny? Well, I was going to say, I'm Sorry, I'm glitching because there's no cover here. And normally there's pieces of cover, isn't there? Yeah. Yeah, I've just got contacting Destiny 2 servers. I think they're prepping for um, late Prep. fall. Because well, they I... are doing a huge change and they need to start prepping for it, like... I think starting tomorrow or something like that. Yeah, but the thing is, I bet they're shitting themselves at the moment because if they fucking... Could you imagine if they do that update and it just basically erases people's characters again? Yeah, there was actually only one confirmed uh, one-off like that. The others were actually fake. Oh, really? Yeah. There was only one confirmed case as far as I'm aware. Um, no, it doesn't. It sounds like buzzing, as if you had... Deep bass reproducers. Um, are you sure it's not a steam-powered vibrator? A big old-school style one. Like if you have a quiet electric drill. Yeah, I'm going steam-powered vibrator. That's what it is. You know how big those fuckers were. <laughs> you had a like, team. They were the size of a. They were the size of a fucking bathtub. You had a team of five. Um, Five sort of Irish guys that were really, really good at fucking shoveling coal. Every now and then all you'd hear is MORE STEAM! Fucking take it in shifts. Oh, and just so you know, um, Elk is also a Men in Black. Or a member of Men in Black. I discovered this the other day. How did you find this out? Um, because Elk openly admitted that um, the Czech Republic was the Earth's first line of defense against alien invasion. So I said, wait Why a minute. Why Czech Republic? Um, I, I can't remember what the conversation was. We had a conversation and she said, oh yeah, yeah, we're, we're like the first, first line of defense against... Uh, against alien invasion, I went, wait a minute, does this make you uh, one of the men in black? And she went, maybe, but if I told you, I'd have to erase your memory. Yeah, they have to use the uh, neuralizer for you. But, um, uh, what you call it? They had, they're based in New York City. They, they might just be like a shadow agency. Or, you know, may, maybe they are like one of the branches of the Czech Republic. Yes, he just threatened us with orbit to death from above. Let's get moving. As you said, you know, America is the great melting pot. All that raw power. Someday we'll establish communication with the war mind. Speak to it. Understand it. If we are ever to reach a second goal, it will be with Rasputin at our side. Ooh, that was close. I'm surprised none of us died from the electrical beams right there. That's because we're professionals. <laughs> My theory, and I'm sticking to it. I mean, those beams will one shot you, so. I didn't think they did anymore. Oh, mind it's you, burn. I was gonna say, we got arc burn on. Yeah, in a nightfall, they will just. You just look at them funny, they'll kill you. Um, old school is going to the doctor for some fingering because you have hysteria. Really, Elk? Uh, He's not wrong. What, you know what? It sounds like one of those hard plastic vibrators left in a drawer. Don't ask how I know. Mm. 
I'm going to ask. I, I, I like the fact that her next line is, I think I may have forgotten something. Elk, did you not turn your vibrator off? Rasputin's genuinely worried. I think they're trying to bypass his database and gain direct control of the war. I think I told you about my one of my shopping trips with my wife, didn't I? On um on Boxing Day, day after Christmas. No, you haven't. Day where everybody gets something for Christmas that requires batteries. Or you know somebody who gets something that requires batteries. So literally, the day after Christmas, we went to the shop, and it's like, right, yeah, okay, let's get the few things we need. Oh, and we'll buy batteries for all the different fucking stuff that we've got. So we end up going to the till, and you've got all these different fucking sets of batteries. Now, a shopping trip with me is never normal. I do everything I can to make sure that a shopping trip is not fucking normal. Um, so we've put all these batteries on the conveyor belt, and um, the girl starts scanning them. And I just looked at my wife and went, Right, is that going to be enough? Is that going to keep you uh, entertained for the rest of the day? Am I going to be able to play video games while you use that and leave me in peace? And she just went, for the love of God, will you shut up? And I went, there's no need to be embarrassed, you know. Lots of women have them. The cashier's probably about 17. So I turned to the cashier and went, isn't that true? You've probably got one in your drawer at home, haven't you? And the cashier just went, woof, bright red. <laughs> And my wife just went, please ignore him. He's just being an ass. Well, see, it would be funny if be like, I'm talking about a phone. What are you talking about? Well, that was the thing. I did turn around. I, I said something and went, I'm just talking about this. I don't know what you lot are about. Fucking dirty minds. That's what you lot got. The Fallen will claim nothing from this breach. Hey, it pisses me off seriously. I think I'm uh, I'm gonna go up there and be the mean neighbor. Or I'm not used to the noises of living in an apartment. See, I always remember um, going over and visiting my mother. And my this was a long time ago. My mother turned around and said, "Don't um, don't bring a a girl home." Unless you know she can take a joke. And it's like, why? And my mum honestly turned around and went, oh, because if you bring a girl home late at night, I'm going to walk outside your bedroom door with an electric toothbrush. I'm going to turn it on, put it outside the door, and then I'm going to start jumping on the bed. And it's like, mother, please, please don't do that. Please don't do that. I, I, you know what? I just never took a girl home to her house. I just went, yeah, I've got a girlfriend. Do you want to go visit my mother? Nope. Absolutely fucking not. Right, we're going to Saurus Harbor so I can actually test this because I completely forgot about Saurus Harbor. This Nerdaprim, I, I will try not to murder too many bad guys. Because yeah, I, I need to stress test this to see how well I can get it to work. Because if it's... If it requires a fuck ton of people around me to work, then I'm just gonna try and find something else. So what's the premise of this build? Uh, I need to punch, dodge, punch, dodge, and just keep doing that. But I need to get a good group going. So, is this, um, is your melee gonna be charged when you do it, or...? Okay, so, I need to have more enemies around me. Oh, you working on surrounded or? Yeah. Yeah, but at least you get the speed boost so you can get there. Toothbrush? When's your mother's birthday? So, yeah, it was an electric toothbrush, um, Elk. So you press the button on it and it vibrates. So, of course, it sounds like a vibrator and she was going to do that and then jump on the fucking bed. Uh, my mum's birthday is really, really easy to remember. It's the 1st of January. So it's literally, Happy New Year! Right, okay, gotta wish my mum happy birthday. Okay, so... I need to tweak his build.
No point asking me about Hunter's builds, I have literally no fucking clue. No, I mean, when is it, uh, when, when is it time to send your mama a good gift? My mum, or just like a general question, when is the good time to send your mum a gift? Because any time is a good time to send your mum a gift. Fucker. Hi, Dra. What's going on, Dra? Oh, the fact that Elk just got hi, D. Oh, I'd like to point out she's also put a capital D, so she might be calling him Big D. And draw before you tell me off, yes, I was planning on playing Persona 5 tonight, but it didn't happen because I would uh, I started late because I was dealing with all my interview stuff. That's a point. What's the what's the legendary um, lost sector? Oh, and it's arms. Uh, it's on the moon. Barrier overload, void burn, arc shields, solar shields. Okay, I'm going there. Fuckers are supposed to sleep. Almost midnight. Elk just going upstairs, going, Will you please kindly shut the fuck up? Okay, so I think I need to dodge first to get this build going. Well, dodge, punch, dodge, punch. Yeah. Um. Where's the next one showing up? Oh, we must have failed it. Give it a moment, it'll uh, regen. Yeah. Oh, in fact, has it regen over there? Yes, yes it has. Yes. Yeah. Almost midnight, and Elk's neighbours are making noises. Um. Oh, right, it's up this way in here. Oh, got no fucking ammo there. Check out that one. Yeah, because technically, if we leave the um, the nightmares alive, but you keep murdering the um, the little guys, we could practice this indefinitely. Okay, I think that's what it is. Is What? Uh, dodge, melee, dodge, melee. Instead of melee, yeah. dodge, melee, dodge. It's not as quick as I've seen in videos, so... But it's definitely quick. Uh, what are you guys up to? Um, I was just completing some seasonal stuff. Uh, in Hibio, 
currently is fine-tuning a build. Oh, hello! I know what that is. Uh, Phoenix Protocol. Any good? Uh, 64 roll. It's not too bad on the discipline. Yeah, we'll keep it. Oh, no, hang on. Could we keep it? Really? Uh, 1118. Oh, and that's with the recovery increase. Yeah, we're going to keep that. Yeah, that's actually that works out better than our current one. I, I figured out what it was. I have the wrong dodge on. Ah. <laughs> so, now having the right dodge on, does it make any difference whether you melee or dodge first? Uh, I think I'll have to melee first first, because the dodge will give me my melee back. Right, okay. There's plenty of bad guys over here, then. Um, Drow says, do you guys want to blitz some strikes? Uh, yeah. Let me figure it out. Let me find two of this first, and then, uh, going, because it is arc for the uh, strikes. Well, till tomorrow. I shall leave you to murder those. Yeah, that's, that's what it was. It, I had the wrong dodge on. It's because I never use Gambler's dodge. I always use Marksman. Uh, what's Gambler's dodge? Is that where it reloads when you're near a bad guy? Uh, that's Marksman dodge. Gambler's ah, right. dodge uh, gives me my melee back when I dodge near enemies. Right, okay. Yeah, I normally use Marksman if I'm playing Hunter. Which is a rarity. Fuck, it's not the neighbours. It was... It was Ven in the hall? Oh, ventilation in the hall. How can it be this fucking loud? Uh, Drath has well strikes, the heist, whatever. Yeah, yeah, can do, Drath. So, you join the party. We've got, a, we've got a party going, so... Welcome to the party! Got to party hard. Or is it showing me as offline because I'm streaming? Mm, I'm in the party. I'm. I never show up online I, unless I really want to be left alone. Or my brother's using my Xbox. Elk, if the ventilation is, or if the vent is that loud in your building, maybe it is that the. Um... The heating in your building is bust, and that's why it keeps showing or keeps turning on in your apartment. Or has your apartment been uh, a little bit cooler since we uh, we went through the heating procedures? Might not be the best idea, and will it matter if I play a bit aggressive? So you in a bad mood then, Dodge? So me being angry is postponed to tomorrow. Dodge will be angry tomorrow. What's the matter, Dra? Why are you angry? Right, we've had we're our... gonna go to the helm and then we'll go on the strikes. Yep, sounds good to me. Yeah, you, you called him Dodge like two or three times. Oh fuck's sake! I will be angry if you keep calling me Dodge. Sorry, Dra. Why why are you angry, Dra? I'm pissed off with what uh, I know what ha I know what's going on. I I don't. What, something happened at work? I'll let I... him tell you when he wants to. Oh, okay. Has everybody finally just like given up at work and quit and you're the only one left? I feel like this is turning into a therapy session and Wolfie's our therapist. Oh, that's a scary thought, isn't it? I know, right? 
<laughs> hey, I'm trained as a mental health first aider, goddammit. Yeah, but you can't prescribe any medication. Uh, no, but I can send you to the people that do. Uh, no, I've already done all that. I need to do one of these, don't I? Um, just do an Ike Los Hank on, I guess. Hey, look, there's Umbral focusing level three done. Uh, I'm thinking about giving up at work. I'm thinking about giving up at work as well, but I'm having to try and find another job before doing that, which is why I keep doing interviews. I had a fucking another one. I had an interview today, and as I was in the interview today, I had a phone call of somebody else trying to get my CV to set me up with another interview. And that was... That was all after I'd had another agent phone me up earlier today offering me an interview. Uh, I'm sorry to... Uh, sorry, I am not sure what you were asking about the heating. Right, you, the, you said the vent in your building is making a hell of a lot of noise. Well, the vents are normally connected to the heating. Well, is your heating working better since we 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 talked about it the other day? Or are you still having major issues with it? Wolfie, I sent you a video. I think you'll admit it's unreasonably loud. Hang on, hang on, I've got, got to look at this video. Hang on. Right, Alk, two things about that video. Number one, yes, I agree that vent is unreasonably loud. Why the hell does it sound like a fucking steam locomotive? And two, why are you naked in the video? Don't question the second part. Question the first part. <laughs> uh, right now, I have a terrible headache and, I'm, uh, and I've not had a good chance for sleep. Uh, can you not put earphones in? So I'm always worried about putting earphones in because if I put earphones in to listen to music or something when I go to sleep, it's that moment going, one, I'm either not going to hear my alarm when it goes off in the morning or if my earphones have managed to stay in overnight, one of my alarms in the morning, I've run it through an audio um, enhancer and I've upped the volume on it like four or five times. So now the lowest level it will go, it fucking screams at you. And I normally have my phone on medium to high when I go to bed. So I really don't want to wake up at fucking 7 o'clock in the morning to have somebody going, I am train burner! See, if your wife was a prankster, she would put something over your head. So when that plays, when your earbuds are still in, you would hit your head immediately. Get on like a frying pan or something. Boom. Um, see, what I did was, um, when my wife was asleep, I took her phone and I put a reminder in her phone. So now, at, at uh, midday on my... No, sorry, at, at half past five, even, on my birthday, her phone flashes up and goes, Ding! Time to offer your husband a blowjob. <laughs> it's that time of year again. And every year, she... She swears at me and then forgets to turn the fucking alarm off or to, forgets to delete it. For fuck's sake. Um, no proof, no case. For a while I am without sound. So I won't know if you talk to me. Oh, right, okay. Have you not got like a 24-hour a number for maintenance or something in your building that you can ask I'm about to throw some strikes. I am ready whenever.
Oh, that hand cannon's fucking tosh. Lunar factions, boot the assembly. All right, let's have a look. So recovery on those is fucking amazing, but resilience is shit. Oh, uh, this is actually the first build I have that's triple hundo. Oh, nice. I don't think I've got any yeah. build that's ever been triple hundo. Well, this was this wasn't done intentionally because I wanted to focus on the three stats. It just so happened to be they're all hundreds, so it's like. Okay, I can live with that. <laughs> I'm certainly not going to say no. Well, because my first double hundo build was, uh, what's up, draw? Was, um, my stasis, which was, um, mobility and, um, grenade. See, I've double hundoed all of my warlock classes, but I've never triple hundoed. And Hydra! An elk, if you. I, I can it, triple hundo my solar. The solar warlock. What can you tell us about this terminus? I can triple hundo my uh my um warlock. No, I've never nailed triple hundo it. Well, that's good news. Am I actually coming through? Because uh. Yeah, you're coming through. Tell. You are. You are. Okay, it's just it's just uh, obviously got the connecting thing in the uh, party because I can't see when I talk on the screen. I mean, I, you know, it flashed up who's talking. Yeah. Well, you're coming through on the stream as well, so. And welcome back, okay. Elk. <laughs> yeah, if I change a few mods, I can triple hundo. Yeah, but the thing is, it's trying to. Ch it's. If you triple hundo. Um, does your uh, character. If, if I triple hundo, I become more squishy. Oh, that's what I was going to say. If you triple hundo, does your character. Is it as efficient as you need it to be? Uh, it would be more efficient, but I become more squishy, which then means it could be less efficient. Yeah. So it's one of those. The build itself would become quicker, but if I die, the build doesn't work anyway, so... So it's a 50-50-90. It either, exactly. works, it either works or it doesn't, and most of the time it'll do the one you don't want it to do. I haven't tested it because I haven't needed to, because all it actually does to my stats is it takes my strength from 70 to 100 and drops my resilience from 70 to 40. Oh, right. Yeah, I'd probably rather have the resilience, to be honest. Um, The thing is, it's going to be interesting because uh, resilience is changing a little bit soon. Yeah, it's getting a nerf. For tier 10, we'll give you... um. 30%, but it's going to be um, curved where um, I, I was going to say, but the thing is diminishing returns, the more you have I, I was going to say, I think the thing is at where I am, it might not affect it might not actually uh, do that bad for me um, I'm going to order some earplugs has anyone got any experience of sleeping with earplugs in? Um, I think the only experience I have with earplugs is if you're going to have them in for long amounts of time have the soft sort of memory foam ones don't have the um like the the rubbery plasticky ones yeah and here we go if uh, if i'm right but me i might actually gain a little bit of resilience however removing him can only strengthen our position uh what's up class well, I'm a warlock, but I'm a, at tier seven. No, no, no. What's so... subclass? Arc, solar. Oh, solar. Solar. Okay. Because I know for arc, there are fragments where if you're surrounded, you get a um damage reduction. Yeah, I I'm just on about the entire resilience change. I think I might actually gain a little bit of resilience because of being tier seven. Yeah. Because if if I'm right, they're putting every like, every tier to giving you giving you an extra three, isn't it? So no, like they're three, making six, it nine. curved, so the lower you have, the bigger the gains, but the higher resilience, the less gains you get per tier. So it's like diminishing returns, as far as I'm aware. That, that makes sense, just put it so it goes up in threes instead of go, going, it goes up this way and then jumps to the stupid ones. Yeah, but well, it's this way you, you don't have to do it all or nothing. Yeah, but correct me if I'm wrong, didn't they change it anyway? Because it used to be that... For each level you got, you got 
Gotcha. For, e for every skill, it was for each level you got, you got more... You got more of a benefit from that, and then didn't they change it so basically, if you were under thirty in anything, you effectively tanked that skill? Yeah. Uh, resilience. I don't think had anything until a little bit after that. Nice work, Captain. But you're gonna need one more. Boom. Okay, so this build seems to only really work if I'm surrounded by enemies. So basically, make sure you don't get into a situation where you've got either Screebs or Exploding Thralls. Because in yes. that situation, you're fucked either way. Or Exploding Shanks. Or Exploding Shanks. Basically, anything exploding. Yeah, that, this is the one thing I don't like about Ark. It's all like melee build stuff, and it's like, I don't really care for melee stuff. I think Ark is mainly for Titans. Well, Warlocks didn't really see that much of a change, I don't think. He just kind of went... Uh, Warlocks... If, like, with my build for uh, Ark, I can actually get... Uh, I can just keep going off abilities all the time if I get it right. Yeah, but the thing was, you watched my, my build with that. I could do that most of the time before anyway. But, yeah, but um, I mean, I can do it after the change now. I've not played Ark that much since um, they did Void 3.0, to be honest. You mean Ark 3.0? Uh, no, because on Void 3.0, I changed to Void and then kind of went, yeah, I, I'm kind of really enjoying Void. Well, that's because Void 3.0 actually, in most people's um, opinions, was the best change for any of them. I think Solo did really well. The problem I have with Solar is that Solar is basically my defensive build. Um, so it is just that moment going, yeah, I, I can put the, um, the swords on, but if I'm playing Solar, I'm more likely to play well. Because if I want to do damage, I'll sit with, um, sit with Void. Uh, just, yeah, sit with Void. See, my solar build is my fun build. Uh, my Void build is either my fun, okay, we're getting serious, or PvP. Um, Arc is just so I can have something, and Stasis is like, <laughs> everything's frozen. I think my stasis is probably my my least used build, um, and that's purely because I've just sort of gone, yeah, I'm I'm using void so much that I use the others when I need to. Um, but apart from that, eh, stasis, I probably should use it at some point. The warlocks have a really strong stasis build with the Azeomancy gloves. I think that's the gloves I use. It's really strong if you know how to use the Osmeomancies properly. Because oh. a lot of people um, don't realise that if you actually hit the uh, enemy with the uh, thing, you actually get a bit more energy. Oh, which and then can, it, it can refill an entire grenade. I was going to say Elk, so are you going for like the in-ear earplugs or are you going for like the ear defenders that sit over the top?
Boom! Although, I have seen uh, people think that uh, Nightfall Strikes are going to be the one of the best activities next season, or next uh, expansion. I'm because farming, Zavala's, yeah. Because Zavala's getting the rework. Zavala's getting a rework? Does this mean I can m kick the motherfucker off the tower? Unfortunately, no. God damn it. That rework's not reworked enough. They need to rework it again. Jesus fucking Christ, 126 kills. Most of those are melee. I haven't seen a number like that for melee kills in forever. Um, I don't know the difference. If you were talking about it right now, I did not listen. <laughs> but probably earplugs I like to... S oh yeah, right, so you, you go for in-ear earplugs. Not the uh, sit over the over the top. So earplugs, not ear defenders. Alright, so I gotta stop at the uh, tower real quick. And then, uh, what do you guys want to do? I don't mind. I'm easy. Easy like a Sunday morning. I mean, we want to call your wife to see how easy you are. Depends if you buy me dinner first. Generally, I enjoy mathematics, but graphs, that's where I draw the line. I'm contemplating everything in my life up to this point right about now because you said that joke. <laughs> like, oh, I look over a shotgun and it's like, I think Kirk Cobain was correct. Oh, you mean Kirk Cobain's microphone? Yes. I, 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 did, I, did you ever see um, Dodge streaming Fallout? He had a shot. I have not. He had I don't a shot. I, I don't think I have a um, thing for streaming. Oh, right. He has a shotgun that you really loved, and he was doing mm -hmm. all modifications for it. I went, oh, you got to rename it. you got to rename it. He said, okay, what am I renaming it? Kurt Cobain's microphone. And he went, oh, Christ, go on then. So he now has a shotgun called Kirk Bain's microphone. Ooh. This is why we can't have those things. I've just got a ship called Ashamir's One Way Ticket. Uh, it is possible to mathematically predict the cadence of death and resurrection in every firefight, regardless of the combatant composition. <laughs> Ashamir. Yep. Sounds about put right. The, put Put the ship oh, I hate them. those style ships. They always look like a fucking yeah, tooth. They, they look fucking terrible, but... See, and Al Alk says you know, oh, okay, she, she normally yeah, sleeps on the side. I, I normally sleep on my front with my arms under my pillow, or I sleep on my side. It depends on which way the mood takes me. No, I sleep on my side so this way I don't snore. Because if I'm on my back, I'm going to snore like a fucking so-and-so little -so log. Uh, you see, it's, it, again, it's, 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 a, it's another joke, isn't it? You know, men go to sleep with a hard on, and at least that way you know you're not going to roll out of bed. I mean, it depends on the size. You might fall out of bed. <laughs> <laughs> Difference between a shirt and a hard. You know, I think I could probably just about sleep with a shirt on. Oh, I need to masterwork a piece of armor. <sighs> you shall not escape. Elk is you shall not escape on the game pass. If it's not on game pass, I will refund your points. In fact, I should be able to check it on here, I think. Have a look. Let me have a look. About How many what, points do I have for your stream About now? what game it will be, shall I make discussion? All right, hang on. Uh, you shall... You shall not pass isn't on the game pass. So I can't play it. Or you shall not escape even. It's oh, not shit. On... I still need to do uh, 
comp. Ugh. Need to do that for the uh, hand cam. I meant to do that yesterday. Uh, I will help you if you can convince Wolfie. What do you say, Wolfie? Uh, what is it? Three rounds of comp. Uh, can do. We're not going to win, though. Oh, it, win or lose, I don't give a fuck. I just need to do three. Yeah, I'm sure we can do that. If it's only three. Put that on and that on, I guess. You shall not escape. What uh, About what game it will be shall make decision. I know that was my message for you. What you shall not escape. I've nearly got enough points to pick another game. I am going to put that fucking thing up because I'm never going to be able to play any other games else. I've been working on everybody's chat games. Either that or I'm going to fucking limit it. <laughs> yeah, sorry, you guys 17, ready? I'm at 17.4k. Uh, I've unlimited. I'm ready whenever. Yeah, so right. Al, Al, you'll have to have a look on the Game Pass at what game you want me to play. Because it's got to be on the Xbox Game Pass, because I'm poor and I can't afford any of the games at the moment. Oh, oh who play left? Player left for a fire team. Oh, it's because uh, we were stood still for so I was stood still for so long. You should Wolfie, you, you, you need to see if you can find a way to have it so you can basically gamble your fangs. I'm not letting people gamble their fangs. Fucking hell. You'll be sat there with fucking six million fangs going, you got to play this, you got to play this, you got to play this. I'll be sat there going, right, okay, I'm going to put the uh, Choose Me A Game back up to 10 million fangs. No, you've got, to, you've got to do it so you can gamble your fangs and then just put different um, things on that instead of just Choose A Game and put other things as well. If I had the PC to do it, I would try <clears throat> and get marbles on stream, because I think that's quite a fun little game, and Stream Raiders. But both of those are games where stream raiders you just put on in the background and people play it as and when. With marbles on stream, that's where you have to basically sit and and have a camera and it, it's basically just chatting with marbles running at the same point. Or you do um what um. I think it's the Arm Raven does, where he'll play a game and then get after so long he'll do marbles, and then go back to the game. Yeah, I don't mind people doing that. It works quite well. All right, it's Are showdown, so I think it's best of five. We're gonna die, clown. Most positively. I struck first, motherfucker! Arsenic Bite? Fair enough. Oh, he's glorious. Of course. Damn it! Uh, if you guys res uh, are able to pick me up, uh, they'll lose the, oh, uh, the point for the kill. <laughs> I got you first time, but I couldn't get you the next time. Telling lies or amnesia. One minute won't be long now. Um. Check near the heavy. They uh, they grab. I think that's Galahorn. Oh, yeah. Okay, I, I don't think that's working for me. So, oh, I've got my fucking thing as it is. Damn it! Go. 
Guardian down. Oh, I'm not going to get to you in time. Fuck! I'm not going to get to you in time either. Horrors lease a debt. Oh, good kill. <laughs> In Hibio tied the score. <laughs> They're still fighting to be tough. One final push and victory is yours. Alright, just stay alive. Play Don't take any risks, just keep running away. You said that's two of them fucking came around the corner to me. Both are under 10 hours. I think Telling Lies is leaving Game Pass soon. I could be wrong, or has it just come to Game Pass? Ah, cock it. Oh, call it a draw. You're in the lead. Down. Fuck, I killed myself. Oh! Yeah, that horror's lease of depth hits like a freaking train. Uh, if you have not played, played that one, all this war of mine. I have at least one. Well, Elk, it is. This. This war of yeah. mine is on Game Pass. Yeah, Elk, it's your choice. It's it's your point, so you get to choose. One minute. Oh! Wolfie, oh, never mind. <laughs> Wolfie, you're getting shot in the ass. Yep. Your enemy take this without a fight. Oh, we're getting fucking slaughtered in this one. Yeah. Thirty seconds remaining. Oh, he jumped down. I have a good experience with this war of mine. I think. You... Okay, so Elk has redeemed this war of mine. I've really got to play that game a bit more. I played it on um my Vita. I think it was Vita. See the Vita on Nintendo Switch, one or the other. Right, so go on to that for a moment. Round three. Your opponents are in the middle. You can beat them. Oh. Uh okay, we've got shadow shot. Behind us. I got him down low, but I couldn't kill him. Ah! Oh, bastard got one shot on me and made me flinch. Oh, fuck. Near the heavy. Damn it, he's low. Heavy's gonna be up in seven. Oh, I got a chance. So again, I, this is I, I don't play these games. Um, because I suck at PvP. Yeah, I'm not doing too hot either. At this point, I just wanted to get the three games gun done so I get a, a rose hand cannon. They've got Thunder Crash and something else, I think. I have never no idea. Uh, Thunder Crash and a, um, just Havoc. 
Bump. Uh, this. Oh. Oh. Come on. Even with nope, the I'm wrong. That That's shield, a uh, behemoth. We're about to get froze. Yep. Your opponents have won on points. They can be beaten. Fight again. Fight again. Enemy team has the lead. Nothing changes. Win this. Right, there we go. Oh, okay. that's added to the list. And hi, Kags. Welcome back. Goodbye. Yeah, it, it, it's a loss. Like I said, I don't even give a fuck. Only one minute left. Yes. Now show them the true meaning of war. Don't let your enemy take this without a fight. You're behaving. Uh, we're behaving, I think. Alk's not behaving. Alk's behaving incredibly badly. Fuck you! I don't have a bit of I got three kills now. That's super. Nope, they won. You lost today. But there's no stop. Ending videos of vibrating. <laughs> uh, I'll be back in a second. It just loads in. I'll be back before we actually get into the game. No, it takes us back to orbit. Yeah, I'm just saying, load us into the next one. I'll be back before we get before we get into it. <laughs> okay. Even I don't know. Alk was sending me videos of vibrating things and saying, "What do you think, Wolfie?" <laughs> Wolfie, be nice. I'm being nice. Um, I'm gonna bring a different weapon. I'm gonna make me. I'm gonna bring a different. Ben and Men behaving badly. Oh, so nothing you wouldn't do? No, it's uh, no, it's absolutely. It's it's nothing I would do. I would never do such a thing. I'm as innocent as the day is long. I'm back. Welcome, Welcome back. back. Well, you still haven't loaded in. Yeah, I didn't get a chance. I was checking something out real quick. Well, they. Oh, tell us a bad joke. He is not lying, but it was a vent. Yeah. She, she did send me a, a video of something vibrating. It was a vent in her building, and it was making fucking terrible noises. Uh, bad joke, bad joke, bad joke. What did the drummer name his twin daughters? And a one. And a two. Terrible. That's why it's I'm... a bad joke. I knew that joke. <sighs> hey, at no point does it say, tell me a bad joke I've never heard before.
Rift! Oh, Rift. I fucking hate Rift. What was that in I fucking hate Rift. I don't mind Rift, but I think the 3v3 Rift is a bit of a stupid one. That's what I mean. 6v6 Rift is kind of, is actually okay. Woo! Grenade got it! <laughs> Got two killed. Push forward. Your runner is advancing. Your team Hi, has bye. The enemy rift. Uh, oh, I'm watching the stream all night. I've got to take my pills. Anti kid pills. Here I come. Uh, let's play Wolfie's favorite game of UK versus US. How much is CAGS paying for fuel? Nowhere near as much as we pay in the UK. But it's okay. We'll have our pancakes with eggs in them. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Oh, I didn't get my grenade off in time. Spark has arrived. He's going... Going round to the right. Uh, he's sort of coming through centre. Yeah, he's in centre now. Yeah. Here to your left. I'm not going to get back in time to stop him. Ah! Ah! God damn it! Uh, uh yes, it's was it was it three point seven eight liters to a gallon? Uh, something like that. You work on basically four. Um, but we. Yeah, in the UK we work on litres, and it's fucking expensive. They're coming from the outside. One of them's flank, gonna flank all the way around. Oh, the fucking crimson. Right, they're going around the outside. He's nearly there. The enemy ignited your rift. Two dollars per liter. And if I'm correct with my conversion, it'd be I don't know, that'll be close to like eight bucks. Yeah, that's per gallon. So that, no, we pay about half. That's roughly what we get in the UK. It's really fucking expensive. Fucking crimson just wipes him, wiping people out. Mhm. Mm because it's really good on console. That's why. I killed an entire team with my grenade! Nice! Defend your runner. Alright, it's clear. No, it's not. You, you, you killed the guys at the end. You didn't defend it or come after the guys that were coming to kill me. <laughs> I thought you were pushing up with me. I didn't even know where you went. Last time I saw you, you were. 
<laughs> just on the one side. Oh, look what you have. Push will see. Okay, let me go first. One dead. Oh, I'm dead too. He's behind Damn you. It. Never mind. He's in centre at the moment. How the fuck did he not die firing a rocket at point blank range like that? I'm gonna take this, okay? Ariani's just casting over, just run. <laughs> An arrow came past my head. That wasn't mine. Uh, it's going down center, it's going down center. I fucking hate this spawn at this end. It's going around the left side, it's going far left. Still there, he's dead. It's Enemy just outside by my corpse. Your runner has the spark. Runner down. God damn it. Fuck one to the left. Uh, I think he's going through center He's again. pushing around. He's pushing outside. Enemy runner stopped. Guardian down. Just shoot him. He can't get the res if you shoot him. Okay, Wolfie, grab the spark and come with me. You've taken the spark. Get to the and literally just stay behind me. I'll collect this and I'll uh, I'll just do this. Cool, well um, I was hoping I that just, they'd actually I focus on me. I just literally grabbed being heavy too. Yeah, there you go. Cag says it's eighty-two dollars to fill her truck. Where Alka said, for sort of in the in the in Europe, you'd be looking about one hundred and sixty dollars for the same amount of fuel. Yeah, I was hoping there they'd fo just focus me because I was the bigger threat. But no, they did play the objective of it. I'm taking this, okay? I will say, SMGs do feel really nice again. Oh, oh, what the fuck? How come my fuse rifle didn't actually go off? He's coming around to the right. Yeah, he's going outside. <coughs> Sorry. Oh. Damn it. But no, lost. There's no point using my fuse rifle. Uh, Wolfie, just hold on and we'll back you up. Um, yeah, right behind you. There. Is... One's dead. Alright, we're gonna push bottom inside. Yeah, I'm pushing mid. Another one's dead. Go, 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 go! I'm going, I'm going, I'm going! <laughs> and we win. <laughs> Come on, I thought that was brilliant. It was that moment where you just heard a Nibio go, oh, that's a loss. And as the guy's running towards, he's like, no, I've got an overbomb. Go fuck you and your team. <laughs> I, I got a they... kill! I think, I think the thing that looked there was the fact that they, uh, obviously, YouTube went around the bottom where I went, around, I went straight through the mid. 
and then they focused you two. So I just went, I'm going to kill you, and you, and then I'll help back them up against you. <laughs> uh, every time I bitch about the price of fuel, Wolfie's, uh, Wolfie likes it. Uh, likes to put me in my place. Yeah, damn straight. Fuel over here is a fucking fortune. Although, on the flip side, again, eggs over here are actually quite cheap for what they are. How the hell does that work? What? Uh, Olivia, what competitive division are you in? And Wolfie, what competitive division are you in? Uh, untested, no points. I am okay, in yeah, silver one. How the hell does that work, then? What do you mean? Or is, sil or is silver better than gold? Uh, gold's better than silver. I was going to say, I'm in gold three. I'm still untested, so I don't mind. I want to know how the hell I'm in gold three. I lost every match apart from that one with the fucking ranking thing. Uh, um, just I... because you lost, it actually calculates your individual skill. Well, I, I do need to go see Zer after this. Okay, I'm gonna now I'm gonna rephrase this. How the fuck am I in gold three when I know you can beat me hands down in crucible? Uh I've been slacking in crucible. Yeah, see I get maybe twelve I, I miles a still... gallon, so my truck needs fuel once a week. Eh. I still reckon if me and you had a one v one, you'd win. <laughs> no, you beat me in the last two one v ones we had. Crackly audio from both guys. Well everybody's got crackly audio, is it just Although, I think the crackly audio might be something to do with Twitch. Yeah. Uh, it's survival, so... Ah, uh, I'm dead. <laughs> They're all out there. Thank you, Draw. Heavy's popping up. Oh! I hit him with my, with my snorries, but I didn't kill him. Did he really just try that? Yes. Alright. There's two left. Flag should be popping up soon. I'm dead. They're at the back. That I got one. Get the what last guy sniping behind that pillar. Both teams out of dead. You obliterated the enemy. Uh, yes, of course you go 100 miles. Uh, it depends on the make and model, actually. Okay. His bullets bend, apparently. Oh, good shot. Dead man's tail. Fuck. This is it. No more lives on your side. They're going to wait for us to come through the door, so they're already aiming. Yep. They're going to wait for us anyway, because they're in the winning position. Yeah, and I got knocked out. I was getting hit All by, right. um, was it, night, Child Elk. of the Old Gods. Right, Night Elk, have a good one. Night Try Elk. and get some sleep. Hope the vent doesn't play up too much for you. How many ranked matches do you have to do, Wolfie? Me? It's not me. It's uh, Inhibio that... No, no. It, I might like for your... Because you, you should have picked up a quest from Shax. Uh, I have no idea. I think it's seven. Yeah, if you need to do seven. You pick up the uh, quest.
You're glowing in here, so they know where you are. Three lives left. No, fuck you in your child of the old gods. No lives left for your enemy. Crouch doesn't Every work step. that well. One minute left. The enemy is out of second chance. I'm gonna let some mouse graphics out. I don't have a rocket or anything. I just waste it. At least they don't have it. One's coming around the outside. I knocked one out. Knock the other out. Just stay alive, he has to either push us, or... Yeah, I'll just, I'll say, I'll just kill him. <laughs> oh, one of them dropped out. Oh, never mind. Jeez, I got four kills. Nah. Go left. Because they're expecting us to go up those stairs. Middle hallway? Yep, they're in the hallway. Oh. I nearly managed to kill, was it Catfish Billy? Oh well. Tagged. Dead. Nice. There's another one just around this corner. He's dead. Only Got him. No lives left for your enemy. Killed the guy with heavy. I've been knocked out. Heavy's on the floor. They picked it up. Uh, looks like the guy's got a grenade launcher, so be careful. Dead. All up to you now. I'm out. Destroy. It's a one v one. Oh no, it's a one v two. I'll just come back. And Wolfie gets both of them. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, shit. Social victory. I didn't think they were close enough for that, to be honest. Uh, they, they weren't really close enough. It was, I think I ran forward and they both saw me running and went, we'll both pop out and we'll we'll get him. And I luckily had my uh, my super saved. Uh, it's not the role I'm looking for. Oh, well. <laughs> I'm top of the team! Yeah! Wow, I got the least amount of deaths in the entire game. Oh, my combat efficiency is more than two. Oh, God, there's something wrong with the world. <laughs> guys, guys, we need to do some more Crucible. I need to lose. My my uh, my combat efficiency is far too high. Well, we can go back into that if you want. No, no, I'm good. No, we don't need to do any more Crucible. It's fine. It was a joke. We never need to play Crucible again. Yeah, I'm good as well, because uh, not only did I get a rotating hand cannon, shitty rules, I did get the, um, the weekly tramp as well. Uh, yes, yeah, so I do need to go to Tower, actually. Yeah. I need to, I need to go see Shax. <laughs> I need to go see... Yeah. Hey, Wolfie, whatever happened to the pedal point for me? Oh, yeah, I need to reactivate that one. Sorry, Cags, I completely forgot about that. No, you yeah. just didn't want to do it, because you kept making the pedal too much. Well, no, because that did have a limit on it. No, I disabled it because... And that limit was still too high. No, 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 no. I disabled it because I've got a set of... Um, steel toe cap boots. And they look like fucking uh, Converse skate shoes. Um, and the problem I had was that when I wear them... They they work really well to protect your feet, apart from the fact that my one ankle, they literally... It's not that they rub my ankle, it's, it's almost like they pull my ankle. And the problem with that is that it's the ankle... I, I swear it was from the boots themselves, 
but it's the ankle that I had Achilles tendonitis in where it starts to basically shred your Achilles tendon. Um, and I disabled pedal because my ankle was giving me fucking all sorts of grief again after wearing these boots. Um, and I've just completely forgotten about it and haven't fucking haven't put it back on again. So no, I will enable that again. Only once a stream. No, I didn't mind doing it more than once a stream. It was just didn't want to do it when my ankle was fucked. Ugh, those boots are shit. My bros hand cannon has slide shot and opening shot. And has a range masterwork. Oh, I that one. Inhibitor, is that any good? Uh, which one? Rose. What's the uh, roll? Slide shot, opening shot. Opening shot? Uh, if that was a shotgun, that would be a card roll. On hand cannon, eh. It just doesn't have the oomph, even with opening shot. Uh, either, either way, it was getting dismantled. I was just asking him what, the, what it was like. Uh, Mike Raccoon ears are ready. Woo! I'm just saying I only redeemed it once a stream, just so just so others could do it later. No, no, say it was... I think it was... If I remember, Pedal was done so basically it, be, it could be redeemed and then there was a 20-minute timer on it. Um, so it could be redeemed every 20 minutes. Although I am going to put the fucking amount it costs to, to choose a game for me up, because that's just going to be fucking wild, else that I'm never going to be able to play a game again. Um. Welcome back. Good luck. <laughs> what, are you, what, what are you going to put up to, Wolfie? $260 million. Uh, I don't know. Probably something like 40k or 50k. That's a fair amount for non-regulars like me. Oh, unlike me. I was going to say, non-regulars like you, Keg? <laughs> well, the thing is, though, Keg, I don't think you can limit it to... I think you can limit it to one once per person per stream. Um, well, with 20,000 points, you're not going to redeem it every stream anyway. 30 to 40,000 points, that's ridiculous. Really? You see other streamers, they've got it set to 100,000 points. I have mine set at 20,000. Okay, I won't change the price of it, but I'm just going to end up with a list of games that freaking long that I'm never going to get through them all. I think you should up the price because it should. I, uh, it's one of those where yeah, but but the moment I say about upping the price, everybody complains. So I just I just won't bother upping the price. Everyone will just have to wait. For until I get round to playing the games. Or if they leave Game Pass, then tough. I was like, I'd up the price because that way it, it, it's one of those, right? It'll be your regulars who can get who get the shoot the choice. But then it's your regulars which you're trying to uh, please while bringing in others to become regulars. Uh, I meant the pedal one, dear, not the game. Oh, no, I'm not going to up the pedal one. The pedal one, I think, works really well. Game one, I'm going to up to... Uh, I'm thinking of upping to 30, 40,000. No, I, I wouldn't put the pedal one up at 30, 40,000. Not for fucking five minutes of pedaling. That would be ridiculous. I don't think I can do anything with this Forsaken Cypher. I think I've, um... I think I've got everything out of the full... No. They've got everything out of the full... Forsaken Scythe? Scypher. Oh. You had three of the Forsaken Cyphers? I think I've got everything out of the Forsaken campaign. Oh, apart from the... 
I don't have the ta uh, the Taraba. But I also don't have enough spoils of conquest. I say the Taraba is quite good. Out of 240 spoils of conquest, I have five. See, that's what I thought you meant. Uh, we were on the wrong page. No, no, no. I, I, I wouldn't up the price of the um, the pedal one to thirty, forty thousand. Fucking, I, I didn't. If if I put pedal one that high, then it would be like pedal for fucking thirty minutes flat out, and uh, that ain't gonna happen. <laughs> I think you should do that. That sounds like fun. Uh, yeah. Okay, I'll do that. I'll set that at like three hundred thousand. Right oh, I ordered a Wolfie merch. What did you get? What did you order? Uh, need new emote ideas too. Maybe a sad Wolfie emote. This is Wolfie. Wolfie is sad. You know what, Cag? I think for an emote, we need a, a, re a, a yellow duck. A yellow rubber duck that just says Philip across it. His name was Philip. What's the plan then? Uh, I don't mind. What do people want to do? Oh, like, yeah, we could have a text one, but it would have to say F star CK a duck. Fuck a duck. What do people want to do? Do people want to run strikes or people want to do gambit? Think of it as training guardian. I don't know. I'm currently playing the two, the two main things I need. Uh, I well, the two main things I need to do are spire the watcher on my hunter and my titan, and the deep stone crypt raid. See, I'm just in Shax's office listening, not Shax's office, in um, Zavala's office listening to his mixtape and playing with his executive toys. Fantastic work. Okay. Uh, to answer your earlier question, I made a custom shirt design for me. Sweet. So have you got a one-of-a-kind shirt then? Is that what's going to be? One day when you're free, we can work on some stuff. Yeah, because we, we talked about... I might about... actually hop off for the night. That's fair enough. What do I need to do for some of these challenges? So... Complete heist battleground without dying. Complete crucible matches. Stun champion. Master of work a piece of armor. Earn the, the Valis X and actually do the fucking... Um... <laughs> The ornaments for it. Defeat Guardians in Momentum Crash. Uh, what do you still need to do? I need to do... Come out for your uh, weekly triumphs. Oh, for the, the weekly shit. Um, weekly, not seasonal, I take it. Uh, da, 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 da. That's Deep Stone. What's the other featured dungeon this week, by the way? Uh, I think it's Prophecy this week? Yeah, yes, you Prophecy. Um, I'm going to hop off and actually get something to eat, so it's been a long day. Fair That's enough. fair enough, sir. Wolfie, do you want two-man prophecy? 
Uh, yeah, can do. All right, so I'll catch you guys later. Catch you later. Have a good one, sir. Yep. Uh, don't forget, Iron Banner starts tomorrow. Ayoro banaro. Prophecies and legend. Uh, oh, my fight. Am I the adult? I have no. I'm assuming so. Unless Hibio hasn't left yet. I'm not the adult at the moment. I must be the adult now. Uh, let's quickly switch to a sword. Uh, what are you running? Solar. Are you running well, or...? Yeah. Fair enough. I will stick with Nova Bomb, then. Nova Bombe! I was about to say, looking at my stats going now, they seem a bit wrong. Yeah, it's because I hadn't actually equipped the uh, other... Where they're exotic. Uh, more like testing a concept idea. That's fair enough. Guardian, do you read? Eris, I got this. Go Wee. back to yelling at that tree on Io. You need a handler, rat. And the Guardian needs support. You're going to have to dark. Yeah. I had to remember how to actually uh, do the thing. Grenade button, innit? Ah, uh, it's trigger. There it is. So, what, what concept were you testing, Kang? Set up. Yes. 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 It's all right. We were doing. Um, well, I was doing uh, fucking heroic nightfall earlier. I keep thinking I haven't set my character back up correctly, but I have. Ali hop. It's probably going to be better if I put the Lamant on, isn't it? Alright. Ready? R ready whenever you are. Whoop. It's a little bit warm out there. There we go. 
Have you... Oh, you've done all the dark then. Yep. So just make sure you're stood in the light when... Uh... Nope, I'm it out. Thank you. Okay, I've got the last ones. Ready when you are. Is that the pulse rifle? No, it's a sniper. Ah, oh, I fucking bollocked. What was it? Uh, slide shot, snapshot sights. Snapshot's good in a PvP roll. Slide shot, no. I don't use any of this for PvP. Now here's the first lot of lights. Go for the bonus chest first? Ow. Yeah, that's what I was doing. It's over here. Uh, dark is before. That's a pulse rifle. Yeah. What's the um what's the auto called? Uh last breath. Last breath, thank you. That's why. Or I want freaking pinnacle chest piece. Oh shit. Throw that down there. Uh pinnacle chest piece, pinnacle Helmet or pinnacle uh, class side. If I get any of those, then it's something else I can mark off on my way to our top level. I uh, say, so you max level yet? No, yet. Three points off. I found the next lot. One, two. Uh, when you get a moment, check Facebook Messenger for picture designs. There is no. That worked, wrong I'm sword. Dead. I know, I'm coming in. I didn't even see which way he went. Where I went. It's over there.
the way is open. Doing tricks. Okay, shot up. Ow, my face. Is the one over by you? Uh, yes. Why'd you jump? Because I knew exactly what you were going to do else. I was going to oh, run me down. Oh, hang on. I got I got to hydrate and I got to stretch. Oh. I'm stretching. Right, yep, yeah, I'm ready. Okay. Uh, so he's over there, we need light. Blinded by the light. They're dark. Uh, I got three light over it. Got to collect them. Yeah, I gotta take out another hobgoblin. Center. Is on the ceiling. Uh, I've seen one hobgoblin, I don't see the other. Oh, I've got three dark. Oh, other hobgoblins up there. There's a dark behind you. Uh, right. Are any of these actually dark? Santa. That one is. Wee. Yeah, it was about the only one that was. Uh, we need light. Oh, God damn it. Fucking knight moved sideways as I pulled the trigger. He's weak. Uh, that's dark, so that's no good. Fucking hell, that knight just chased me down. Right, it might end up with dark, but I'm just going to clear the board a little bit. There we go. Right, one, two, I have three light. And I've finally got Devour Burning up as well. The other knight is near the... Uh... Yeah, I got him. It's right in front of me. 
Uh, turret runs over there. And boom. Sent up. Uh, yeah. I thought I don't. Did that just heal you, by the way? Yes. Uh, we need dark. So, me proccing heat rises actually healed you. Okay. Why did you need to heal you? Uh, I thought it might heal you, but I wasn't sure. Uh, uh, I'll be honest, I didn't even know what we needed. ceiling again. Yep. Yep, he is. Oh, both knights are up. Um, I got light over it. I got dark. I'm bringing this with me. Was that a dark one? Yeah, it it disappears anyway. Uh, oh, been useful wasn't... anyway. We like to. I think that was the last one. Rent is paid. What, for another month or? Forever and ever. We got, I think we've got one more after this. Oh, yeah, okay. this is this is the last one that we've got to do now. Oh, I got sniped. Thank you. Right, so he is on dark. I need to kill the other sniper, I didn't know where he was. He did. Right, so this should be the boss then, shouldn't it? Yep. Just for a well, month on top that bridge. Boss is... I got this one. Got this one? Reloading! And he's dead. Sarah, key I got a last breath. Ugh, I got channeling wraps. Got fucking gloves. I, the fucking best not be top level. No, they're not. 
are actually not very good for my build. Nothing, uh, nothing in this will be top level apart from the final thing. Ooh. Darkest before. The stats, with... the stats might be good, though. Actually, that's a real shame. I have a darkest before with overflow and full auto trigger system. Oh, if it didn't have full auto trigger system, that may be useful. I was going to say, it's a real shame because before they did that mod, full auto trigger system would have been one that I would have taken. But now that they've put the mod on it that everything can have that, there's literally no point in taking it. Ribbon Road. Are you going to try this without uh, stop boosting? No. Let me just try and get through it. The th I think thing is, it's actually this landing anyway. Well, I'm wondering if there's a... a, a if you land on the ribbon road once you start boosting if there's a point where you can no longer stop oh fuck hey, don't worry just carry on like i say i don't think i can get to you you can if you use heat rises but either you have to wait for your grenade which would still be about the same amount of time Ooh, that could be death that that's very much death okay bye world Oh, I'm uh, definitely not before you died. <sighs> I was wondering if there was a ledge I could uh, stand on, but they were actually interlocking ledges that basically you slid down one, then you slid down the next, and the next, and the next, and the next. Uh, I think I changed the money for my rent over um, a couple of days ago, so it just needs to get drawn out of my account, that's all. I think my rent is cheaper than yours, Cag, but then I also think that your house is bigger than mine. Fucked it. Uh, fifth. Oh, thank you. Fifteen fifty-four for my house. Three bed, one bath. Um, we pay five nine five. Um, that probably works out to about. Oh, rescued. Probably five nine five. That probably works out to about seven hundred, seven hundred and fifty dollars for a two bed one bath. But then again, it's like you guys normally have sort of kitchen, then you have a separate utility room, then you have like a huge lounge, whereas we've got uh, a relatively small lounge. Pardon me. Um, where all of our uh, you tip where all of our utilities are so like washing machine uh, tumble dryer stuff like that that's all in the kitchen we don't saw the man cannon we don't have a, like a utility room for that Um, we don't have any studies or art rooms or anything like that either. Don't forget the chest. Hey, not it's over here.
A long um, walk. Oh, the long walk is a good sniper if you can get a good roll. Uh, what did I get? Outlaw quick draw. Uh, no. Again, quick draw is good. Quick draw is a good PvP perk, but um. Fuck you. Oh, bye, draw. <laughs> it's determined you're not getting back. Yep, pretty much. Ah, you revived it, mate. I murdered everything there with one grenade, one melee, and two shots. Um, yeah, I'm gonna keep my, I'm gonna keep my um, black talent on for this. I think. Uh, I'm gonna try using my fire, uh, fire and forget. <gasps> no, in fact, I'm not. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna take. I'm gonna put the fucking sleeper on. Yeah, and I'm going to use Fire and Forget and try that. Fair enough. Uh, we turned the sunk in den into our bedroom and one of the bedrooms into my art room. See, we don't we don't have dens and stuff like that in the you UK. You ready? Uh, yep. Uh, dark, light, light. No, that's dark, dark, light. Oh, is it changed? Right, it was dark, light, light a minute ago. Well, there's all the light ones we need. I just generate some more light. Oh, I got three dark. I got three more dark. Right. I'll pick up these three. And is that fun? The only thing we will have to do is uh, essentially wait for my super. Yeah, that's fine. But that won't take long. So just hold your super, there's more duck. Oh, I got these ones. So, boom. Is that one? Because if Murdered. we get some, uh, if we get some scions so I can kill them with my grenade, I'll get my super really quick. Ooh, that's dropped the heavy brick for me. Is that going to stay in nope, the next room? Cause, nope, because we're on a different side of the room. Shit. Which is a real fucker, because I actually have two heavy bricks in here. It's why uh, I used some of my heavy on the uh, ogre, so I knew I wasn't going to be able to keep it. Oh, right, fine. How are we far is your super? Sand spawn? Yep, there we are. Right, I I will stay away and let you murder them all. In fact, no, I'm going to come over and stand by you. Um, for the simple reason being that as you murder oh, yeah. them, they they might drop some ammo for me. Like that. There we go. There we go. I got some special. And away we go. I'm going to run to the left. Uh, run to the right and put my super. Not on that platform just to our right.
Right, I'm going to leave those two at the end. Okay. Uh, well, if you can get your snap on him, you might be able to just lay grenades into him. Uh, I don't have my snap. Uh, right, okay. Uh, hold on. If I oh, can get... made it. I'll take that. I got four grenades out of five on him. Well, certainly made him shift, so... That's not bad, really. I know we've done better, no, that's but... quite that's, qu that's quite good for two people. That was... If that was three and we didn't get a kill, I'd be disappointed. Ew. But I'm completely out of heavy now. Yep, same here. Uh, dark, light, light. Safe haven. Uh, there's a third. Oh, I think you've got the third light there. It wasn't registering. Need one more light. There you go. Uh, oh, oh shit, those are dark. dark. You grab those then. There's some light. That's where I got light here. Uh, where you guys? Get my devour going. <coughs> oh, I've picked up a light, mate. I've got dark mates again. I'm just taking out the ogre. Oh, I got one block of heavy. Fucking none, I think. We'll run around and look. Got no heavy, no special. I'm full on special. Got nothing dropping for me again. Well, I just got another block of heavy. No heavy, no special. Uh, do you want to wait for another round or just go? Uh, wait for one more round, see if I can get something. Wolfie, I'm two for two on disappointments on my online Walmart purchases. Why? What did, what did you order and... What what was wrong with it? Oh, there's a block of heavy. And a block of special. And another block of heavy. Giggling at. What? What are you giggling at? Did you not realise that your health kept going back up? I, I did see my health going up. I was like, Fucking hell, I'm taking a long time to die here. I should be dead by now. <laughs> yeah, I, I uh, used one ad to proc sun braces and then just kept he, uh, kept holding my grenade with next to you. So I kept proccing heat rises while I stood by you. 
which then meant that you kept getting healed. See, the thing is, I could use um, could use my grenade and just fucking end all of this really quickly. Just that moment going. Up. Actually, at the moment, they seem to be dropping ammo for me, which is like very, very nice. Right, let's put that down. Not like I'm going to run out of ammo in my auto rifle, is it? All right, let's go do a bit of a, uh, a bit of a walkie walkie round. So, oh, that's that's a lot better. Me, me liking that. Huh? There's another block heavy for me. I'm now full on heavy. I'm not quite full on heavy. I can get one more block of heavy, that would be rather nice. Some special. Grab that special. I am watching my health go up every now and then. Oh. Yeah. Well, is that about you watching your health? I said I was watching my health go up and F up every now and then. I can end most of this with one move. With most one move. Just one snap. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Thing is, if I do that, there you go. My devourer's going. I'll be honest. I didn't actually realise how uh, well I can actually make my healing, put out my essentially my healing bit. So I've got my super, and then if I don't have my super, I've got uh, just healing. I just want them to drop one more block of heavy and then I'm more than happy to go. If they don't do this time, I think we should just go anyway, personally. Put that there. There's plenty of special around for me. Yeah, I've got loads of special drop in now, it's just... That fucking last bit of heavy I want. Ah, uh, fuck it, let's go. I, I've got 11 heavy rounds, so... What's your max? I think 14, 15. Okay, so you're not missing much. Do the same as last time over on the right. Sent back. Same. He's off. I took care of a few of the snipers. Oh, Christmas tree! Oh, Christmas tree! <laughs> You are all brown and dead now. You're not! I can do it again! <laughs> You'll be dead in a second, then. 
There we go. Um, I ordered what was supposed to be a lovely pink strawberry foxtail. It's less than a foot long and ratty looking. The nine were utilizing both light and dark to fight the guardian. Drifter, what have you done, you insufferable? Uh, the belt doesn't even fit me, and the tail mount is ugly plastic. How am I supposed to be a magical, cute strawberry fox with a tail that looks like it wants so that it went through a blender? Fuck's sake. Dark are means to survival. It's not about saints or sinners. The Vanguard wouldn't abide that answer. Vanguard ain't here. I'm sick of their dogma. What do you think, chosen one? Come on back and I'll get you paid. Yeah, I can see up her nose. Uh, ooh. Oh, mm -hmm. the resilience well, was higher. Those would be good gloves. What is it? Uh, six mobility, two resilience, uh, twenty-one recovery, twenty discipline, nine intellect, two strength. That's not too bad considering resilience is a. If you um, use a mod, you can. Um... Get uh, just 10 off 3 points. Yeah, they're a 60 roll though, that's the problem. Okay. It'd be better if they were a, a 60 something roll. Well, if you want to fine tune armor, you, uh, the best bet will be waiting for Grasp of Avarice to come around. Oh? Go for Artemis armor. Oh, yeah, that's true. <sighs> and then farm the fuck out of it. But again, the thing is, what I want. I doubt at the moment... slightly more damage than you. I. Which, I'm actually quite happy with, considering my uh, role on my um, thing isn't the best. On my fire and forget. So the damage output could be higher, and I've, ju I've only just beat you a sleeper. Ash, not a problem now. Right, uh, I'm going to go to... Well, I'll be back in a second. I'm going to go to the loop. Okay. Nyong. So are you going to send that stuff back, Kags, or... Did you see that shirt sign? No, let's have a look. Angelic wolf pack. Already packed, labelled, and ready to go. I look rather funky, Kag. Uh, we're going to send in here. I think the only thing that I sort of looked at and went, why have they done that? They've not put a capital A for Angelic in Angelic Wolfpack. They've put a small A, but they've just made it bigger. <laughs> Or is that... Is it, I don't know, that might be a writing style in the US. Stroking the dog, eh? I know it's cursive, but I, I thought they'd have still had a, a capital version of the A, not just a big, small A. Known as Elegant Font. Ooh. It is the capital, yeah. That's fairish enough. It's not calligraphy. Oh, all of these are too low. There's nothing I can do with them. Uh, 
<sighs> I'm back. Welcome back. Are you playing Good Boy Protocols? Uh, no, I, I've done Good Boy Protocols, but I'm just... Uh, I was just getting some armor off um, Rasputin, but it's all shockingly shit, surprisingly. Uh, let's try uh, again. So it's yeah, shit. Were the rolls still high though? Nope. I wasn't focusing it. I was just picking up engrams off the top corner. But I think. Uh, okay. I think even the focused armor from Rasputin's not the best. I got a 63 just. Really? Fucking hell. But um, uh, I always found I always found the best one for armor rolling at the moment is the uh, Crown of Sorrows. Yeah, Crown of Sorrows probably followed by the War Table, I think. Yeah, War Table or Crown of Sorrows are the best ones. Catch Crash one was shit, and Rasputin is mediocre. He either yeah. gives you a good he either gives you a good roll or a shit roll. I. Uh, ironic, because it was the English that brought cursive over here and set the, the font face for it. Gothic and uh, calligraphic writings were bought by the Europeans. I like the black and white wings as it feeds off what you say. There are two wolves inside you. Yeah, I, I agree with that, Kags. I think that works well. However, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, I am going to have to call the stream there as it is half past midnight here in the UK. Um, we will be back on Wednesday. Hopefully, we'll be back on Persona 5. Um, we were going to play Persona 5 tonight, but quite frankly, interviews and stuff got in the way. But if you like what you have seen, please drop us a follow or go onto Facebook. You can follow us on there or like on there. And we also have a TikTok where we are putting silly videos up. It's all Angelic Lone Wolf. And if you can't find it, then please feel free to go to the um, About page on Twitch. And it is all linked on there. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, look after yourselves, behave, don't do anything I wouldn't do. My name is Philip. Yep, don't do anything I wouldn't do. Behave yourself, and we will see you again soon. Bye-bye!